So, since I've already started, uh, we are we are gonna go to the Hawk Army. Nice Hawk. Yeah. Anyways, let me read. Let me read chat. Uh, Zeppi says, "A Radiant Dawn." Yep. J Smash says, "You're only on chapter two. and then Zeppi says, "Of part four. and then he makes a Sora noise. And Zeppi says, I'm getting ready to send this sauce. Big and then, sauce. And he says, one day you should stream three houses. Oh, you really want me to suffer, do you? <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm sure Ze Zeppi will play three houses because I'm... I'm sorry to say this, shakeup, but I'm gonna skip three houses. Well, yeah, he might. I don't know. Holy shit. We got, uh, we got the funny Xbox gamer goddess. Yeah, she is Xbox, <laughs> obviously. Yep. And, uh, funny thing, Elijah asked me to, um, he asked me to make him play not? Infinite Pit tonight. Why not? Why not three houses? <laughs> huh. Uh, so, Zephy doesn't want to play three houses? I don't think anyone wants to play three houses. That dog shit game. <laughs> I don't think, I don't think any of us like three houses. Nope. But the characters are good, though. At least, for the most part. Yeah. And also, I realized my dinner is not actually done yet. It still has, like, five minutes. So, like, probably gonna peace out in, like, four minutes to go get it. But, yeah, we can at least do this, like, open and cut scene. I don't know how long it'll take, though. It won't take that long, I'm sure of it. We're spotted by the enemy. They're over there to the southwest. Yeah! How did they get so close without m being noticed? Did we have men out of position? No, I just checked in. Enemy force just suddenly appeared, with no sign or warning at all. I mean, everybody hates Violet, so... I mean, I like her, I, I like her boobs, but that's about it. <laughs> well, Jacob... You, well, Jacob, you just literally ranked every tier list character of having who has the best uh, trailer. Yeah, and guess what? Byleth got dog shit tier. That's unsurprising. Yeah. I now, now, Jacob, I will say this once, but most of your most I would I will say most of your picks for for what's the best trailer are kind of overrated. I will say this much. I just based them on how cool they were. You just. <laughs> Okay, we're we're not gonna talk about biasism because I tried to put my I tried to put my biasism aside. I just think I just think the three how I just think Violet's reveal trailer was boring because it, it, in my opinion, any of the reveal trailers that look like in-game cutscenes for a different game look it's kind of mid, honestly. Unless it's done like extremely well, like Joker's trailer, for example, I think it's just oh, honestly well. pass. Well, obviously, Jacob, I... Uh, the only reason why I enjoy Joker's freaking trailer was it literally stays true to the original source material and how stylish it is. Yeah, but guess what? Three Houses is not stylish, and neither is Fates, so it gets no points. <laughs> Could you name another trailer that's really stylish? Um, I like... That's exactly why I ranked Sephiroth's trailer so high, because... It, it works with the Smash art style, but it also looks like it came straight out of Advent Children. So, well, yeah, that's I mean, why I like it I've, so much. Literally, Advent Children came out in 2004. Yeah. And that movie ate, literally aged like fine wine. Exactly. But anyways, enough talk about stupid Smash Bros. <laughs> I might, ultra fail. I might talk about more stupid Smash trailers once I have my dinner and get to the map, but for now, yes. uh, yeah. I'm just gonna call it super stupid smash smash trash ultra tr ultra fail. Well, the difference is trash is actually good because that's a good mod. Yeah, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> oh yeah, and Jay, you want to hear something funny? What? Me and Zeppi were playing as Bird so many times <laughs> that I actually figure out uh, Bird's move sets. Wow, great! Now you can Nova Strike and do all kinds of crazy shit. Yeah, I mean, I literally, I literally call the specific move of freaking Bird Lady, uh, call it Nova Strike. Yeah, I might start calling it that too, honestly. Apparently, she's basically 
uh, Mega Man X. Bird. If she doesn't have the super arm. Bird or, is or Mega least, Man X. Or at least the ultimate armor. Anyways. Guess that's a good thing about fighting a goddess. Things are sure gonna get excited. Everyone, get in position! An entire legion that can appear from nowhere? Who are these disciples? To be honest, I don't care who they are. I just want to knock a little disorder back into the world. Oh. Well. Okay. Good. That was good a... Okay. Good timing, because my my dinner is done, so you can set up. Okay. Sure. I guess so, yeah. I literally don't have anybody else. Lucia, however, I'm I'm definitely gonna keep her. Now. What's funny is that I don't even have this much units to use, sadly enough. Now it's time for the Quad Queen to shine. Well, shit. Wait, what? What? What, what the, happened? What the hell is Mercy? Okay, let's check what Mercy is all about. Where is the skill? Is it on Alincia? Oh. Wait, so that's wait. Is that a is that, is that a bad skill that I see? <laughs> It literally allows an enemy to retain one HP when they... Dude, it's like false swipe, except as a skill. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, Jake... Jacob, maybe I should remove that. Maybe I should remove that. Mm, are you able to remove it right now? No. Oh, you might have to go... You might have to reload then. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Thankfully, I, I can reload. Yeah, that's base. Yeah, basically, it gives miracle to the enemy. Thankfully, it's removable. Why, Thankfully, yeah, yeah, why does she have that? <laughs> I don't even know. All right, let me see. Um, oh yeah, and also I forgot to read this message, but they said if you guys are gonna play three houses, which house would you pick? <laughs> eh, I'd probably say blue lions. Oh, okay. They th they thought you were gonna pick Golden Deer. <laughs> I would only play Blue Lion since, you know, it doesn't. So Dimitri doesn't get killed. Mm, okay. He literally gets killed in every route if you don't choose him. <laughs> Unbiased. So you so um so what is um so Dimitri's kind of like Shinjiro. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, he dies in most playthroughs, but you can save him on one specific playthrough? Yeah, pretty much.
Now, let's get started. If I were to go for a second playthrough, I would most likely play as the Golden Deers because it has a lot of good characters. And holy shit, <laughs> she kills! Not surprising since she has stun. Oh, and yeah, I'm gonna level. Yeah, I'm gonna level her up quickly. Oh, hang on, we got some. We got some more sauce incoming. Sauce. <laughs> oh, not that. But you guys get to see that too. <laughs> Anyways, we have Ooh. we have um some Khalil, Khalil sauce. <laughs> And Nephany, oh, ne Nephany getting embarrassed around Khalil. <laughs> that should be a good thing. <laughs> Your beautiful backups have arrived. This would <laughs> this would get a ten out of ten if they didn't misspell your. They used the wrong your. Is, this... is it is it the your with the you are or? It's it's it's, it says you are you are battle beautiful backups have arrived. <laughs> I hate to be that guy. <laughs> It would have been better if she says, you are beautiful, after all. I mean, she could have also said that. It would have been nice. That's kind of where I expected that to go. <laughs> <laughs> already, already got started? No, oh, everybody's just killing. I mean, it is a battlefield. <laughs> I know, but still. Wow. Oh shit. Why doesn't she do damage? Oh, I'm, I okay. I kind of see why. Was because armored, well, it's because of the armored knights. Oh. Well, then but why at are least you attacking I'll give her one. Yes. Hey, it works. <laughs> <laughs> it literally works. Holy shit. Hmm, I wonder what her maximum strength is. Yeah, Dimitri is what? mid, Edelgard is hella mid, Claude is pretty solid, but Endgame's beautiful. Who's Endgame? That's a, we that's a weird per uh, person in Fire Emblem Three Houses I've never heard of. What do you mean? <laughs> I'm just messing. Oh, so her maximum stat is like 20 23, at least for a Swordmaster. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty nice. I mean, I like I like I like Endgame too. He's a pretty cool dude. He uh he kind of makes three houses a little more bearable. <laughs> Jacob, Zeppi is literally making me appreciate how good uh God Shattering Star is. Really? No, that's unexpected. Yes, you can't. End Endgame in the Verdant Wind route. <laughs> she gets stuck. <laughs> wow, okay. You see why Alencia is worth keeping? Yeah, I see. She can she can constantly level up strength and speed. Well, that's something that uh Midkaya can't do <laughs> for various reasons. What am I eating? Uh, smiley fries and chicken nuggets. I bet that's good. Specifically, smiley fries with cheese on them. Because fries and cheese go really well together. You know what also go goes well with fries and cheese? Gravy? Chili. Oh, I did not expect that. <laughs> it literally goes well with chili. I, trust me when I say this. You can get it without beans, you know. I might have to try that. The fuck is a smiley fry? Um, look it up. <clears throat> look up a smile. Look up smiley fries. They're pretty good. And I literally have less units to work with, if I'm gonna be honest. Hey, at least you have more units to work with than um, Midkaya. The funny thing is that the silver-haired army. I could literally get more. I could literally get more characters. In that army, because I literally swapped out most of the characters. Hmm. But yeah, <laughs> literally Captain Falcon is worthy of keeping. If I decide which one I should, which, 
which of the ten characters I should bring along. Wait, what the fuck? Romhacking.net is shutting down? What are you talking about? Bro, I use Romhacking.net all the time. Why are they shutting down? What do you mean, Romhacking.net? That's where I got a lot of my cool ROM hacks from. Well, that's really disappointing to hear. Why is it even shutting down anyways? I don't know, I didn't bother reading at all. <laughs> Jacob, sometimes you need to read. It's like, um, it's like five I'm paragraphs. Some, I'm saying sometimes, not all the time. Just sometimes. At least read between the lines, if it's easier. Let I'm just see. saying. Um, I miss the times I was able to interact with a smaller group, so okay. Let's see. I mean, it's not like it's not like all the ROM hacks that have been made are going away. They're getting archived, but still. Yeah, they are getting archived. Oh, and Jacob, by the way, I was trying to you. I was trying to install Fire Emblem Genealogy of the Holy War through a virtual console by using New Super Ultimate uh, thingy. What's it called? What? <laughs> it, it, give me a sec. I'll look into my files. Okay. It's called New Super Ultimate Injector 3DS. I have not heard of that before. It's basically like like a program where you install a specific ROM file just to play the game on through a virtual console and stuff. And yeah. <laughs> oh great! Oh, why is this <laughs> why is this douchebag back? <laughs> well, we're about to kill him anyways. My humblest apologies. I hope we didn't sneak up on you. I'm sure that cheeky little queenlet is still amongst you. I hope so. I'm going to make a pay for defying me. <laughs> right. But yeah, it basically uses the features of ins uh, if you use a ROM and then and then uh, make it as a virtual console game, then it will just play it as a virtual console. But then. But then when I installed my ROM, it just kept crashing on... It just kept crashing the game. Oh. You're, yeah, probably, basically you're, free. you're probably better off just, like, putting an emulator on your 3DS. <laughs> oh, I, oh, I did that. I actually did that. So I so I decided to give up, and... Yeah. <laughs> ROM is faster. I did the, so yeah, basically, I just, uh... I just basically used the SNES 9X... There you go. Now you're thinking with power. Yeah. Or now you're or playing. At least, with, I guess I should say you're playing with power. <laughs> that's exactly what I was about to say, Jacob. Yeah. And my hair is come really on, bothering Lucy, me. I think it's time for a trim. All right, come on, Lucia. Give me both strength and speed. That's what I'm going to aim for, anyways. Nope. I hate this game. <laughs> I hate this game. <laughs> Actually, no, I don't hate this game. I love it, but sometimes it doesn't give me a good enough RNG. Well, that's what they call a love-hate relationship. I know, but... I still love the game because of how hard it is, actually. I don't know, it doesn't look that hard. What about... I mean, yes. What about the specific chapters that was truly hard? Like, fighting <laughs> against the Grail mercenaries. That was pretty hard. Section 1 was definitely, like, the hard part. But yeah, like I was saying, fighting against the Grail mercenaries was literally hard enough. Because I can't kill Ike with Slow Kaya. Yeah, you couldn't kill Bike. But if I had enough magic and speed, then I would potentially end the chapter pretty quickly. Yeah. But I but I realized that there was one chapter that was even worse. Well, just, a bit, just a bit worse than, than that chapter. 
And it's, uh, it's chapter, it, it's the end game of part three. Because literally most of my units kept dying. You know what chapter I hated? <laughs> what? The one where you had to burn all that shit. <laughs> yeah, the, I the literally arson, got a game over because, I literally because, got a game over because of that. I mean, I hated it more just because it was like one in the morning and I wanted to fucking go to bed. <laughs> I understand. But yeah, fuck, but that, hey, fuck that chapter. At least, <laughs> at least something good come out of come out of that chapter. I just wanted it to make Heather OP. <laughs> That's true. Because seriously, I love Heather so much. She literally outranks Micaiah, in my opinion. Come on, give me strength! Yes! Yes, I love you, Lucia! And Zeppi sent me some Iris Heart. I'll be honest, I'm not- I'll be honest, I'm not really that big on Iris Heart. What's your problem with Iris Heart? I don't know. Just not too big on her design. She's not that fun? Mm-mm. Okay, that's understandable, I guess. She's pretty powerful, though, in-game. He has, like, one of the strongest EXE moves. <laughs> You're oh, shit. On. Give me a- give me a sec, Jacob. Somebody's calling me. Okay. The funny thing is that I was actually upset of what happened on Tuesday night. What happened Tuesday night? My parents didn't buy me a chicken wrap. Oh, uh, rip. No chicken wrap. Yeah, because I specifically told them that I want one. <laughs> and... Yeah, and they didn't even listen to me because they were just busy uh, take, taking the dogs to to get washed. Rip, no chicken wrap. <laughs> yep. Like I said, I actually do have dogs. Yeah, I think I remember that. Yeah. And the funny thing is that they are actually newborns. So they probably be around as old as my dog. Yeah, they basically they were around like September, and the other one was around on October. Hmm. They might be a little basically. Bit, they, they might be older than actually. No, I think I think um this December my dog will be turning two years old. <laughs> Mine's are months old. You captured the Puppo Saka Yafumo. Oh, yeah, <laughs> you know, Jacob, I, oh, yeah, oh yeah, I like that. Oh right. Let me move let me move the chat box up here. That you know, Jacob, I still I still want to get a Fumo someday. But I'm just well, gonna keep bothering my parents over and over again. <laughs> well hey, maybe you should, also, maybe you should get a Junko Fumo then. I will. I will. Because because I, because I'm gonna be honest with you, I really want to fuck Junko so hard. <laughs> All right, might add that to our context. <laughs> Shut up, Jacob. <laughs> Even though I didn't get strength, but it doesn't matter. He got defense and, uh, he he literally got defense and res, and speed potentially. Speed is key. Out luck. <laughs> he, he maxed max out luck. Yes, he did. Well, thanks for the Jake. thanks for thanks for the Kasumi sauce, Zeppi. Jacob, literally, my Brom is gonna be even better than my Path of Radiance one. <laughs> I'm not joking. He's actually gonna be the best. Great then. All right, I'll be back. I am not that mad. <laughs> Mon Alencia, give me best level up. I love you, Alencia. <laughs> yes, Alencia, you're my bae! Yes! Marry me! Now 
This is why I want to keep you. I... <laughs> this is why you are worth keeping, because you constantly get... Give me so much good level ups. Come on, Mia. Come on, Mia. You can give me as much of a good level up as <laughs> Ilincia. Yeah, fuck you, Axe Man. And you die! <laughs> you die. Okay, that's fine, I guess. All right, Jim Carrey, it's time. It's time for you to shine. Yeah, Jose popping off all of her level ups is pretty funny. I know. I just get excited to see good level ups. Now it's time to chain shove. It's time to push. Yeah, push. I would be much happier if freaking Khalil gets more magic, since she is underleveled. Khalil could definitely go in the top Radiant Dawn waifu list, that's for sure. I just want to make a tier list where I just want to rank all of the characters, like I said. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Yeah. We'll do that. Once we finish all of the Fire Emblem games, Oh, I was just thinking you should do a Radiant Dawn tier list. I'm just saying I'll just wait until that happens. I, mean, I wouldn't mind seeing just a Radiant Dawn tier list. <laughs> That's fine, but I don't think there exists one just yet. Eh, I'm sure there exists one. There <laughs> only exists. <laughs> and Zeppi's going to join in. Sure. He actually wants to join in as well. Yeah, wouldn't be the first time we've done that. Oh, fine. You get to keep your res. Uh, okay, at least I'll get two more level ups. I mean, at least four more level ups. She is, she is getting good level ups, I will say this much. I was about to choke on my spit. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, because I was talking so fast. Just like talking Tom. I'm, thinking, I'm sure you don't uh... remember I'm sure you don't remember that mobile game, but I just but I just remember it when I was a kid. Mm. I don't think But you've I heard do. of But you've heard of Talking Ben the dog. Unfortunately. <laughs> yep, unfortunately. Zeppi, you joined plenty of tier lists. You joined, uh, the Mario Kart Wii tier list video. You joined the, um, Smash Ultimate character tier list video. That's already, like, two videos. But you know, the funny thing is that... That literally friggin' Talking Ben was around for a decade. Hmm. Memes are weird. Like, <laughs> so, like something that was around for like 20 years can suddenly just randomly pop up and get like a shit ton of um, relevance for no reason. You wanna know what's the relevance that we do like that was decades ago? What? Like I've just said, the Mr. Incredible meme. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that I that, that I that was, I like. That one was good because it's funny. <laughs> 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 oh my god. Yeah, that is funny. Well, yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't blame you for not remembering that, Zeppi, because that was a long-ass time ago. Like, at least, like, exactly. two like two years ago for the Ultimate one, and then, like, four years for the Mario Kart Wii one, probably. Mario so, here. Yeah. <laughs> Mario here. Oh my goodness, guys. <laughs> that one looks like Jim Carrey's just blocking. 
And I want to do another. I want to do another tier list um, next Wednesday with the boys, where we're gonna go through and rank every Mario Kart 8 Deluxe track. I will say this once, Jacob. I really don't care about Mario Kart 8. Me neither. But it's 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 something easy to just do. Yeah, I, I, I think I think I did a Mario Kart 8 Deluxe tier list a long time ago, but that was before the booster course. And Jim Carrey is fully leveled up. Yeah, he is, even though he didn't max out strength. Yeah, that's okay. On his left. Yeah, it, it, it's one point, so I'm sure it's not that bad. Yep. Well, come on, Mia! Give me good level ups! Give me fucking good level Put ups. Put Peach Gardens in low tier? Oh yeah, I forgot, you don't really like that remake, right? I thought Beach Gardens was good. Oh, that is a good level up. Yeah. I, I don't know, Zeppi doesn't like- uh, they, they fucked up the music. Yeah, that is true. Yeah. I feel like um, I shouldn't rank- What about which one, though? The, the original DS one? The... The Wii? At least? Since I'm sure nothing has changed on the Wii version. Okay, well I feel like I feel like I should not take music into consideration when ranking the tracks because for one, I usually just replace all the music anyways with my own shit. So <laughs> that's not gonna I'm not gonna take that into consideration. One the one the one music that I didn't like being remixed was Rainbow Road 3DS. Meh, that's a that's a hot take. Some people like the new one, some people hate the new one. I know, but <laughs> so it's mixed. So it's a mixed reaction, after yeah, all. Yeah, or as Arlo, or as Arlo calls it, spicy take salad. <laughs> but I will say this, Jacob. The reason why I enjoyed Rainbow Road 3DS was not only because it's unique, and I do like the idea of a Rainbow Road being a section track. But I, but I just feel like the music in Rainbow Road 3DS just felt so, you know, magical or majestic. Yeah. One. I was watching with my, my girlfriend earlier, and she still, she still says Mario Kart DS Rainbow Road is her favorite. Yeah, I can understand why, since even though the track, even though the track is not that special, it's, it's nostalgic. I will say it's pretty nostalgic. She wanted that one to come back for 8 Deluxe, but sadly they didn't. <laughs> what did I do, Zeppi? <laughs> oh, is just getting all the slander tonight, I guess. What did I do? Dude, what did I say? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Was oh. it me bashing about wait. Rainbow Road? Oh wait, he gets he gets to be a marshal now. Yeah, he gets to be a marshal right now. Holy shit! I thought I thought he was fully maxed out on levels. I guess not. I guess he get, I guess he can max out his strength after all. Yeah, he can. True. I wish we got Airship Fortress instead of like Mario Circuit. <laughs> yeah. Mario Circuit's so lame. Hey, you got Luna. Luna? <laughs> Damn, that's, that's pretty Luna good. The first time I, see Luna. I loved it playing Airship Fortress on Mario Kart 7. Yeah, Airship Fortress is really cool. And I also wish they remade Maka Woohoo and Woohoo Loop. Those are the tracks that I really miss. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> They should make uh, Zeppi. They should make like a Wii Sports. Uh, they should make a Wii Sports Cup or something. Okay. So Zeppi, what did I say that makes you mad? <laughs> yeah, Airship Air Air Fortress is good. And I love that Khalil just keeps dancing like Ileana. Yeah, that's true. I think all of the uh, will, mages do that. Eliana will always be cool. <laughs> this is gonna be cool. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> I 
Wait, what? I didn't... Oh, he says that I... That he says that the Wii uh, Peach Gardens was good when they... I mean, what? I mean that's the one I grew up with. I grew up with Wii, Pe with Wii Peach Gardens, so that's the one I'm used to. <laughs> and I, I, mean, honestly, I, I see nothing wrong with that one. They have the... I grew up with Peach Gardens from the DS version, and I think it was a really good track. Yeah. But but in my honest opinion, I think the original uh, the original Peach Gardens was will always be the best. It will always have a special place in my heart. I'm, I'll give it a listen later. Yeah. Yeah, MK, I don't know, I don't know, I haven't heard in a while, because I have not listened to any of the Booster Course track music, because, I don't know, I just didn't play MK8 much, and I find it very forgettable. So, yeah, I... <laughs> sometimes I just don't, don't like to talk about biasism, because I can make people angry. The French accordion was deleted? Oh, yeah, that, that probably would, uh... That's like the entire identity of the song. So basically, it has some kind of French Brahm, melody. Brom also has Luna. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, this has gotten to the point where armored units uses Luna. Uh, you know oh, what? Brom is not getting any strength right now. Uh, you but know at least he's being. But at least he's being speedy. That's true. You know what one of my favorite really? you know what one of my favorite instruments is? What? The French horn. <laughs> the French horn. Yeah. Usually my favorite in Usually my favorite instru instruments are synthesizers and electric guitars. Well, I mean those are good too. I mean I, I like a lot of instruments, but in recent times I feel like I really like the French horn because the French horn is it's kind of like a trumpet. Except it sounds a little different. And it's, um, it's an instrument they use a lot in Mega Man 8 soundtrack, and I find it very nostalgic sounding. That's and understandable. I, and I just found out that Paper Mario uses the French horn a lot. And I've, I, I, Honestly, I, I've, yeah, why I've, don't, why don't Armor Knights usually learns the skill Luna? That's literally, that's literally what their prior skill is supposed to be. Yeah, I don't know, that's weird. Yeah, I've listened to Paper Mario soundtrack all my life, and I never really noticed that, like, yeah, a lot of songs have French horns in it, because I'm not really good with instruments. Well, I'm at least better at with instruments than I was ten years ago, because I know a lot. Of, I know a lot about instruments now. Sometimes I wonder if most PlayStation One music games uses synthesizers. Sometimes, Mega Man X Six is a good example of that. The game uses both um, pre-recorded music and uh, synthesized music. Also known, as, also, been, also known as streamed music. I've always been fond with synthesizers. And holy shit, 21 damage, but it missed. 26 damage. Well, 26 damage. Well, okay, what are the mages gonna do? Nothing. They're gonna do nothing? They have no hit three. rate. But just three hit rate? That's just awful, man. Oh my god, where do they come from? Give them Luna at level 5 and make them learn Aegis since they're shit at tanky magic. Make them learn Pyra and Mithra? That's crazy, bro. Jacob, Aegis means blocking magic. Oh, interesting. That's literally what it means. It's literally meant to block any magical attacks, bows, and uh, dragon stones. What about, the, what about Dragon Balls? <laughs> idiots. Or should I say, buttheads? You're a fucking idiot! <laughs> I can play that. <laughs> yeah, that works too. I remember back then I used to be a freaking Natal Guard fan. Yeah, now you hate Natal Guard. <laughs> yeah, because she done horrible crimes and stuff. Wouldn't that make her a baddie, though? Yeah, but not a good baddie! <laughs> <laughs> not a good baddie, yeah. I love that four times hit. 
Yeah, she, like I said, she is literally the queen of quadding. The quad queen. The quad queen. Yeah. I'm so glad that I gave her the friggin' the friggin' paragon. Just so she can constantly level up. Yeah. Only two more levels. Only two more levels left, and she will max out her strength. Yeah, I bet you're also glad that it's playing the Shadows of Valentia level up song. <laughs> it literally sounds very triumphant when you listen to it. Does it sound like that in um, Fire Emblem uh, Gaiden as well? I'm not sure. They're saying that Alencia hasn't been skipping leg day, yes. <laughs> no, she hasn't skipped oh. leg day because she has the best legs. Oh, you know what? Ig well, I mean, what? Uh, ignore, ignore Moobot. I'm gonna, I gotta fix that later. Boob. Moobot has been timed out for 60 seconds. <laughs> Moobot, I have not updated Moobot. I just got 400 bits today, so I need to update that message. Oof. Jim Carrey is losing a lot of spears today. Oh, no. Does anybody have... Okay, maybe... Maybe I can... If I can give him axes... Yeah. I have a good idea. I'm gonna give him axes. Here. Let me, let me time out Moobot for a bit longer. Like... 90,000. <laughs> Moobot's been timed okay. out for 90,000 seconds. I wonder that what he, I wonder what that equates to. Mm, let's see. Uh, ninety thousand seconds in minutes. Um, fifteen hundred minutes. Okay, how many? How much is that in hours then? One thousand and five hundred. Sixty-two hours. Okay, that's a bit too long. But whatever. Sixty-two hours. Well, honestly, the sixty-two hours should be good enough. That's like three days, three or... Days. Uh, I'll, 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 I just want it to be timed out for the rest of the stream. I gotta fix that message later. I, I Honestly, I, I should probably just get rid of it. it. I kind of find it funny that Moobot will be, won't be responding in three days. <laughs> well, until I untime it out. You know, three days sounds kind of fun. No Moobot. Well, I have to up the threshold, because here's the thing. Um... Let me explain. I don't think you were here for when it happened. Yeah, imagine timing out a bot. Yeah, because I'm fucking lazy. I don't feel like doing anything else with it right now. Yeah, I know. Okay, so... Recently, one of my chat members... He made a mod for Ultimate, right? And he said he wants... Yeah. And he said he wants me to play it. And I said, I'll tell you what. Because, uh, you, you remember me and Light, right? Maybe. Well, he made a sort of spiritual successor slash sequel to Meme of Light called Animation of Light, which is just, it's Meme of Light, but instead of memes, it's like cartoon characters. And he says, okay, that... and he says he wants me to play it, but I said, no, I fucking hate me. I fucking hate World of Light. So I'll play it on one condition. You need to, you need to give me a thousand bits. <laughs> and so he actually did. <laughs> so now I kind of, <laughs> now, now I kind of have to play it. Even though you don't want to? I don't want to, because I hate World of Light. But I said I'll play it if I reach the 1,000 bits threshold, and now we have. So, now I have to make a new incentive for 2,000 bits. Makes sense. And I don't know what that's gonna be yet. Okay, now I have to kill the guy who has the crossbow. Cause that fifty percent chance is is possible, I will say. Yeah, that's a yikes. <laughs> Bro is doing fifty-two damage. I mean, the wind damage, I don't have to worry about. Oh wow! Th <laughs> oh wow! Three <laughs> ran three from? three random guys popping in. Wait, you see that, Jacob? That is scary AF. Wow! Why the fuck does he do that much? Because they're crossbows, Jacob, they're supposed to be powerful. Hmm, yikes. Oof. That was a close one. <laughs> hey, 
Well, and, then... and great. He's one experience away. Well, they'll, they'll level up, I promise. I guarantee it, Jacob. You really need to level up Lucia. <laughs> I, I know, Jacob. I know. I know. Oh, I'll level up someone Lucia. Sending, someone's messaging you. Okay. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> oh my god! See, I, I like I like this battle music compared to the mid brigade theme. Anti protect Alice smoking. <laughs> Great. Alice smoking. Yeah, Alice smoking. <laughs> That's something that you don't see every day. Well, I mean, you saw the stream title, right? <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Radiant doll. Alice is Ike confirmed. <laughs> Radiant doll. Yeah, Radiant doll. <laughs> okay, that's funny. It's Funi, like Boonie. Yes, Boonie, like Super Boonie. I remember that. <laughs> yeah, you guys remember Super Boonie. You know, Jacob, the one thing that upsets me the most is that I kept losing to Cerno so much. <laughs> That'll never not be funny. <laughs> Why not? Is it know. not even... You're saying it's not funny? No, I'm saying it is funny. <laughs> so you're saying that- You should have said that will not stop being funny. Well, yeah, I said that'll never stop being funny. Oh, okay, maybe I misheard you. Actually, no, that's, not what, be... that's not what I said. That, I said that'll never not be funny. <laughs> okay, maybe I misheard you. Yeah, it's kind of like, um... I forget what they call it in, in, in English, but that's kind of like a, um, a double, like a double negative or something, I forget what it's called. Where basically you say two negatives twice, oh, yeah. where, to where it basically just means, like, the normal version. <laughs> Alice would be saying, I fight for Marissa. I fight for she my definitely friends. does fight for Marissa, I will say this much. I fight for my friends. <laughs> yes! Yes! Yes. You see, this is why I love freaking Mia. And like I said, she will get Allendite soon. Wait, Mia gets Allendite? Well, if I choose to give it to her, yes. What the fuck? I thought only Ike could have Allendite. Any character have can have Allendite if it's SS rank. What the shit? Wait, you're what are you gonna tell me that um, any character can wield the Binding Blade next? <laughs> no, not really. Only Roy can have it. Boo. That's like saying if you would give, if anybody can carry the King's Fang, other than Alm. Dude, I want to get. Dude, I want to give Mia the Falchion. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Hang on, we got more sauce. We got edgy Alice. <laughs> <laughs> edgy Alice. Yeah, with okay. Booba. And I like, I like, I like Alice. I don't know. I, I kind of been flip flopping to between, you know, my liking towards Alice, and right now I think I'm on the uh, I love Alice spectrum. <laughs> my spectrum. I don't know. I'm, I'm making up shit. I'm talking out my ass. Don't you always do that? Not always. <laughs> you really, you really are an oddball. Yep. But aren't we all oddballs? <laughs> it's like it's like in Metal Gear Solid, where Naomi's like, "You really kill him doing that?" And then Snake's just like, "Yep." Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, that's patricide. Yeah, patricide. <laughs> Fear. Yeet. That's not gonna do anything. Oh yeah, did I already tell you that I figured out how to get custom music working in Soku? Yeah. It's been pretty. It's been pretty cool Ooh. so far. That must have hurt. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna replace every song, just some of the ones that I find kind of mid. 
Or boring. Or boring, yeah. Uh, like, obviously, I'm gonna keep Yomu theme, because that song's hilarious. <laughs> um, it is. Um, and also, I'm keeping, um, keeping Sanai's theme, because that song is a banger. Uh, Marissa's theme, obviously. Reimu's theme. Um, um, <laughs> You'll keep sending Sasso Edgy Alice. Alright, sure, I'm down with God. that. Man, where are all these fucking bows guy guys coming from? Bows guys. There's too many Pegasus Knights getting beers. Yeah, it's pretty lame. I have to give a list to all the songs, because there's some I haven't really heard enough before I can really judge them. Like, um... Mm, for, for example, one song I was thinking about replacing was Broken Moon, a.k.a. Suika's theme. And I was going to replace it with her theme song from uh, Immaterial and Missing Power, because I like that one better. For the Bird Ladies theme, change it to the original. Do you want me to do that? I can do that. That sounds pretty easy. It is. I listened to the original. It's pretty damn good. It's basically just her theme song, but... The main instrument's replaced with Zoom Pits. Zoom Pits? Yeah. Whatever that means. Uh, you don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. Sorry. Does that people know what I'm talking about, though? Yeah, I'm, I know which one you're talking about. You're talking about you're talking about Utsuho Bird Lady, right? Not not uh Aya Bird Lady. We gotta keep Aya's theme because it's the funny it's the funny uh Mexican song. It's great. I've always loved friggin' Nuke Bird. I will say this one. Nuke Bird, yeah, yeah. Nuke Bird, her theme song in Toho Eleven is pretty damn good. Yeah, always. Oof, Lil is really, really low on stats. Rip. And your voice is dead. Why? Well, you shouldn't have. You shouldn't have let that guy get a crit then on your voice. That's not funny. Anyways, <laughs> okay, you really need to learn. Take like some. Uh, I don't know. Are there are there pills for like dead voices? I don't know. No, there really isn't. Like maybe like cough syrup or something. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Oh, now yeah, you, die, oh, you. I was screaming at work. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well, that's news to me. Oh, okay. Yeah, I remember you saying that. <laughs> Well, hey, maybe I should maybe I should show you guys my um my Toho character select theme. Good idea. I might do that after this uh, map, if I remember. We'll take oh, like we'll, we'll take we'll, we'll take like a quick break so I can show off my Toho told my my Soku mods. <laughs> That's a good idea. Yeah. Burn, 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 burn. Now I'm getting kind of scared. Ooh, a panacea. I am kind of worried about... Also, Lucia. Also, apparently it's not pronounced panacea, it's pronounced panacea or something. But, I don't know, man. Panacea just sounds really fun to say. Oh my god. Oh well, no. It's worth... Well, you know what? I'm gonna oh, take no. the risk. I'm gonna Pan take the risk. Pancakes. And now, Crossbow Man is dead. <laughs> Delicious pancakes. Whoa! <laughs> Holy shit! Uh, I, have, I have never <laughs> seen that before. <laughs> oh, is that your mic's dying? What? You, you, you're getting too excited. Your mic's killing itself. I know. And it, and it was worth it. I don't care. <laughs> Honestly, if I ever make a highlights out of this series, I'll just make I'll just make this, the highlights a Jose popping off on good level ups a compilation. 
That'll be the highlights of Radiant Dawn. It won't be anything else. It'll just be Jose popping off to level ups. <laughs> yes, I love you, Elencia. My queen. My queen. You I mean, are my she, queen. I, I mean, she is the queen class. I know, but she is the quad queen. The quad queen. Holy shit. Man, the sausage keeps getting better, guys. Check this shit out. Oh, yeah. Ma Mama Junko. Whoa, Mama. I love Mommy Junko. Holy, Holy shit. shit. <laughs> you I, I don't know why I keep fucking quoting that. It's so stupid. You have no idea how happy I am. I mean, you did it just pop off on Alencia getting a level up. <laughs> I if I ever... He said I love this. You know, Jacob, if I ever finish Alencia, who am I going to pass the Paragon to? Um, who's the lowest level right now? To me, it's probably Khalil. You could pass or Lucia. I, I, I'd say pass to Lucia. She's kind of falling behind. Either that, least or, uh, either that or give it to someone oh. weird like, uh, like Mr. Van Driesen. I mean, honestly, Mr. Van Driesen can't fight. Oh, uh, uh. Or you could be funny and give it to Dev Dan. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Huh. Oh, yeah, I forgot about him. How could you forget, like, one of the best units? I don't know, Jacob. It's just me, by the way. <laughs> just me. Yeah, you yeah, you can't even kill Brom. <laughs> Jose popping up to levels and destroying his mic is good. I think I mean also there's a lot of just funny moments in the cutscenes in general, like oh we I got I should make a cut I should make a uh, I should make an F Zero compilation. Yeah. Just saying him like you need to, you need to play F Zero. Yeah. And there's also F Zero Land. F Zero Land, yeah. So th this would be a, this would be a pretty good uh, one to make us highlights out of. Same with um, Path of Radiance and also um, what's it called? And also Engage. Engage could also probably have a highlights too. That's a good idea. I wouldn't mind doing that. I'm, I'm making a I'm making a, to a Toho Death compilation right now. So maybe when I'm done with that, I could work on something else. Maybe something short. <laughs> Before I do something big like the Path of Radiance uh, highlights. Okay. Well, even though I only have a few more level ups. Oh, oh my God. She. Holy, Holy shit. shit. Oh God. Well, she's gonna cap most of her stats. <laughs> she's gonna be the new. Uh, she's gonna be the new uh, Heather. Maybe, but not yet. Not yet, Snake. So, how long have we been streaming? Mm, well, in terms of actual recording time, uh, 58 minutes. Okay. Uh, I can still finish this chapter. I can still finish it. Disarming? <laughs> what is the point of disarming? Yeah, and here, uh... Give me and a give me a second, guys. Um, I'm gonna go open my curtain, so I'm, I'm I'll be back in a sec. You can keep going. Okay. Also, I have to charge my phone. Oh boy, you want me to pause then? No, no, it's fine. I'll charging my phone is easy as three seconds. <laughs> okay. So don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Yes! Silver Blades for the win! And I see she got a good level up! It's no wonder why she's called the True Blade. Alright, I'm back. What the? What just happened? Uh, I just went to open my curtain because it's a little dark in here. That's fine. Man, this stream, I've been getting so many good level ups. 
Yeah, it's better than the bad level up stream from a while back. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> true. Oh yeah, Nutella make Nutella making Captain Falcon rage quit was also a good moment. Oh, it was a good moment. Come on, give me more speed. Oh wow! Fast. I guess I guess you had to get a mid level up somewhere in there. I mean, wasn't that expected? Yeah. To get a mid level up. Okay, I'll give this level up a pass because I get more res. And I have to finish this chapter quickly. Yeah, I'm not in a rush to go to bed anytime soon. I got like three hours. Oh, that's good to hear. Although I would like to try and keep it under three hours if possible. <laughs> At least below three hours? Well, around the three hour mark or lower, preferably. Okay, that's good. I don't want it to drag. Think. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the engage highlights would be. It would probably just be whatever shitty dumbass stories we came up with. Okay then. Because I I re I think again my favorite part about engage was the whole coke chan coke ton subplot we made up. That made it oh, that, that, that that made it enjoyable. And I, I just I don't know. I like the characters of Engage, but the story sucks. Yeah. That's why I want that's why I wanted us to return to the Telia series to show how good the story is. Yeah. This this really is the Persona 2 of Fire Emblem games, isn't it? <laughs> Wouldn't say that, but sure, that's a good description. Or maybe you could say this is the Persona 3 of Fire Emblem games, and you could say, like, Geonology of the Holy Wear is like the Persona 2 of Fire Emblem or something, I don't know. Yeah. You could say that both the GBA games and, uh, oh, hello. Free... <laughs> oh, great. So what's the fucking goal here? What are we trying to do? We're just trying to we're just trying to route the enemy. Well that's not gonna be very easy considering they keep spawning more damn enemies. Yeah, the head cannon's about Coke Chan and Coke Ton. That's pretty much gonna be the highlights. I don't know, maybe maybe me freaking out over Goldberry's booba or something. I don't know. I mean I'll see, you I'll, did... see, I'll see what I can come up with for that. I mean Jacob, you'd literally say that you only like Goldberry because of what he says in the Japanese version. Oh yeah, yeah. She the stuff she says in the Japanese version is great. She's she she always boasts about how voluptuous she is, which is hilarious. She, like I said, she literally is a narcissist. Yeah. Well, I mean that that's not attractive, but the uh, the part just her just her boasting about her being like. <laughs> okay, I'll I'll put it bluntly. She always talks about how big her booba is, and that's and that's really funny. Like Moonie. Yeah. As much as I hate her character, I really love how she looks like, though. Well, I can say that about a lot of Fire Emblem characters. <laughs> like Byleth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hate Byleth's character, but I like her design. Yeah, makes sense. All right. Oh, there you are, Queen of Hay Seeds. I look forward to scraping you off my immaculate nails. <laughs> Lord Felto, I desire, I desire no battle with you. Withdraw your troops immediately. If you do so, no more lives will be lost. <laughs> Are you touched as well as homely? I offer you the chance to surrender. But you, Lincia, I will only forgive if you beg and crawl and lick the sole of my left boot, specifically. I'm sorry that you feel that way. That's how... If that has to be... I mean, if if that's how it has to be, I'm sorry about my spelling. May the goddess, may the goddess have mercy on you, Valtom. Well, we took mercy off, so there won't be any of that. I can't even speak clearly. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs> well, he, he's dead. Well, he's dead. 
<laughs> What's the reason you like Gold Mary? Uh, cause she talks about how big her boobs are. How big her boobs are. Zelgius. <laughs> and you got Valora. I'm guessing that's an SS uh, light tome. Oh, just an oh. S tome. It can literally just poison. It can poison you. Or a po or does it poison the enemy? <laughs> it poisons the enemy. That's not bad, right? Oh, it isn't. Well, I'm sure of it. I'm sure there are benefits to that, to that freaking skill. Question is, who do you have that uses S light tomes? Ooh, Astra. Oh my God. <laughs> Damn, that looks pretty sick. That's Ostra for you. So are, we're not we're not done here yet though, are we? We still gotta kill all these goons, right? Yeah. I don't think but I don't think the enemy commander, Voltome, will get more reinforcements, I would think. I think yeah, I think if you kill the if you kill the big bad guy, he'd stop summoning reinforcements. Yeah, I think that's how it works. I mean, that would make sense, so you just gotta kill, like, those guys on the left corner, and then there's the guys on the bottom right corner. And I think that's it, that's all you have left. Oh, full show. Well, maybe I can also make a, uh, a Fire Emblem Engage waifu tier list as well. Alright then, if you say so. And, uh, definitely, um, definitely gonna put at tier and S tier, because I'm based. <laughs> They're always based, Jacob. Well, here's the funny thing. I don't know if I ta I might have talked about this or not, but I found a guy in um the Mario Party Netplay server, and he likes Etia as much as I do, which is kind of wild. I wasn't expecting that. I'm not sure if you guys should be friends or not, but nah, okay. I don't know, but I said like, hey man, you got good taste for liking Etia, and then he sent an Etia email, and he was like, yeah, she's great. <laughs> And then I just said, like, what can I say? I like the funny muscle girl. <laughs> Steroids in the muscles. <laughs> and it's also kind of funny just because she's... He leveled up. He leveled up from that. And he's even okay. faster now. <laughs> and he has 69 HP, too. He doesn't need to be fast. Man, he's, he's already fast as he is. I mean, he's Captain Falcon. Of course he wants to go fast. I mean, yeah, it's true. My me. My my. You got a <laughs> coin! Oh, hey, alright, there, there's more Pegasus Knights. Oh god. Alright, you better watch out. Jim Carrey is coming to stab you. And he leveled up again. Wow. <laughs> That's a good level up, I will say. Well, we're almost done. Hopefully nobody dies. I think... Oh, <laughs> you get Luna for your sins. I quite like this I battle like... music, actually. <laughs> okay. I have a few more left, and... The fucking weapon break sound is really funny. Yeah, I could imagine why. Yeah, you heard it, right? Yeah, I have. You heard that too? It's just it's just Darth Vader going, no. Every time the weapon no. breaks. <laughs> Honestly, I wish I added that sooner. But Nobody can kill the freaking quad queen. At least we get to hear him the rest of part four. Well, she's close to maxing out all of her speed. Yep, speed is key, as Jack Septicai once said. Fucking Jack Septicai. Yep. Okay, Khalil. You're gonna get more enemies to kill. The Great Talon. Blue Talcon! Bird up. Literally, literally... 
The, the, literally, the VIPs in this chapter are basically Captain Falcon, Queen Alincia, uh, probably Braum. Mia. Braum. Yeah, Brom. Mm -hmm. yeah, Obviously, Brom. Mia, Mia's good. Yeah, she is. And Khalil, I guess, too. But don't worry, she will be close to finishing up her levels. You know, my, now might be a good time to get a drink, actually, before we finish this chapter. So, I'll, I'll go do that real quick. Okay. <laughs> yes! I'm so proud of you! I am even more proud of you! I love you, Mia. You... You are so awesome, I swear to god. Okay, Jim Carrey is catching up. Yeah, what, what are those spears gonna do, huh? You know what I can't stop laughing about? What? Al from Toy Story, when he's like, <laughs> No! <laughs> what? <laughs> Ooh. I don't know why I keep laughing about that. Okay, you're just going to heal? No. What? I thought we were done with reinforcements, bro. Where do I keep coming from? Oh no, hell no. Oh hell no. That, that should not happen. Oh, hell no. It's time to fight magic with magic. But still, I have to... have to save somebody. Actually, you know what? I only have... I only have two units that can save, uh... Lucia. It's gonna be like the yeah, longest damn chapter ever. Oh! <laughs> no, that's not that's not what I meant to do. Oh god, she's dead. That's literally not what I meant to do. Well, on the bright side, we got um we got Alice's booba again. Yep, that's what I'm happy to see. <laughs> <laughs> Chat member says, hey, look, it's Mia. She's in Smash Universe. Yeah, she sure is. <laughs> Parody. Well, she's doing better now. That's for sure. Yeet. Yeet again. Double yeet. Hey, you guys gotta stop cheating. Did you change the weapon break sounds? Are they saying no? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's really, it's really funny. Okay, that. Okay, I'll, I'll at least accept it, even though I don't get defense out of this. Wait, did you actually suggest that, Zappy? I don't, I don't remember if you. I don't remember when you said that. I just thought it would be funny. <laughs> All right, some more speed for Jim Carrey. Yeah, yeah, here, come, here, here comes those annoying ass reinforcements. I've always hate reinforcements, and hey, she level, 
She maxes out speed. I don't remember when you did. <laughs> Either way, it is really funny. Because now whenever Jose breaks a weapon, Darth Vader should be like, no. <laughs> okay, that is funny. <laughs> yeah, I love that. Wow, he does perfect damage? Oh my god. Rom is literally the tank. Good job, Rom. I might do that in the next FE game, too, depending on how easy it is to edit sounds. Because here's the thing, I don't know what sounds, um... I don't know what sounds, uh... Bates uses. If it uses BCSTMs, I can edit them easier. E easier. <laughs> easier. Oh god. <laughs> Why'd I say it like that? Easily. Easily, yeah. That's a fucking mistake I made in elementary. Where I said easier. <laughs> you say easily. Yeah, that's easily. It. BCSTMs are really easy to do, but anything besides that, I'm not too experienced with. It takes a lot more effort. Um. I believe some, some 3DS games use AAC, which I don't know how to edit. No, well, I'm not that easy. No, I'm not, I'm not like Jose. <laughs> no. What are you talking about? <laughs> we got to hear it again. Sound, okay, that's... sound of fuck. Okay, that's funny. Now Zeppi's the one making funny typos. Really? Yep. <laughs> he, actually, oh. he, he accidentally said, Minus starting to like Jose. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Sounds hella gay. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Why? That's a good one. <laughs> you did it first. Hey man, I, I, I make, uh, I make, my typos aren't even that funny, honestly. Why are my typos usually the funniest? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I definitely have a lot of screenshots of, like, really funny typos. From, from various yeah. people. Um. Yeah. I don't remember any on, offhand. Now, it's time to die with fire. <laughs> okay, that worked. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> it it, you know what it reminds me of when you say "fuck off"? It just reminds me of that scene in Family Guy Star Wars, <laughs> where Peter just says "fuck off," and then he got, he gets put into the the chambers. <laughs> what? Oh yeah, if you guys have not seen Family Guy Star Wars, I really recommend it. I've seen a little bit of it. Holy shit, Khalil literally maxes out almost <laughs> every single stat possible. You've seen all three of them. Good. See, see, good. You're cultured. <laughs> I've seen almost all of them, but not entirely. I, I watched. I watched the uncensored versions because they're way funnier. Just for that part where Peter says "fuck off." <laughs> Oh rip. It's a trap was only made because Fox was begging Seth MacFarlane to make it. Hey, I mean, that one was pretty good, too. Seth MacFarlane what is sometimes based. I mean, they wanted to complete the trilogy. Wasn't Star Wars famously known for the... For the trilogy of episode four to six. Mm-hmm. I mean, to this day, I still wish they made um, you know, the prequels in Family Guy, but I don't think they never. I don't think they're ever gonna do that. Considering, uh, honestly, I think I prefer the prequels to be honest, but that's just because that's what I grew up with. <laughs> I grew up with the prequels. I saw the sequels recently too, though. Yeah, and how are they? They're, they're a good watch, especially when you have the context of the prequels. Oh, okay. 
I don't know, your perception of Star Wars can vary very differently depending on if you saw the um the original trilogy first or the prequels first. <laughs> I am very I am happy. I am very happy with my queen. Yeah, Peter at the Peter at the end says uh, at the end of a trap says I think the Cleveland show will do the prequels, which is really ironic considering the Cleveland show got canceled. So now that's never going to happen. Yeah, it's not going to happen, sadly. That will never happen. Had to get another living with Wario joke in there. Yeah, it's nice to have every living with Wario jokes every now and then. Also, is Captain Falcon like one of the only units to have three health bars? Yeah, I think so. I can't think of very Ooh. many. Oh, Dev Dan, Dev Dan carrying. Well, well, at least he didn't get doubled. He didn't kill. What do you think is the worst episode of Family Guy? Um. Many people would tell you Seahorse Shell, Shell Party, uh, Life of Brian, and uh, The Scream of Silence. There are many bad Family Guy episodes to count. Just saying. I don't know any offhand because I haven't watched Family Guy in years, but the one that I didn't really care for was the one where Brian takes drugs and goes on an acid trip the whole episode. Yeah, I actually remember that vividly and like... Who, who in the right ma mind even made something like that? <laughs> I don't like that one. I'm sure it creeps you out, doesn't it? Yeah, exactly. Well, Jacob, you won't be surprised that there are many Family Guy episodes that uses creepy gags. Especially, vi especially visually. Peter tries to marry Chris? I do not remember that. See, the thing is, is a lot of the a lot of the like jokes and humor of Family Guy really went over my head as a kid, so I'm sure I'd have like a different understanding of them now that I'm watching them later. Well, Jacob, you won't be surprised of how Family Guy is right now. <laughs> I mean, I already have too much shit to watch. I probably won't be in a, I probably won't be binge watching Family Guy from season one to whatever season it is right now. Just watch the just watch the first four seasons. It's much easier this way. I I I watched seasons one to eight when they were on Netflix back in the day, and that's about it. That's uh, that's that, I stopped watching Family Guy after like season eight or nine. Actually, no, I think I stopped at season ten. Cause I definitely saw um, I definitely saw season nine. How come? I mean, I lost interest. The <laughs> Family Guy is mid. Well, yeah, everybody says it's mid right now. Can't blame him. But then again, any show that goes on long enough becomes mid. Like, like, uh, The Simpsons? Yep. Um... And Bob? Yep. We could go all day as to what shows drag on too long. That's why sometimes it's good for a show to just wrap it up after eight or nine seasons and... You know, just call it there before it gets bad. Like Seinfeld, for example. Why Seinfeld? <laughs> Have you seen that one video from the Rosalie Assemp where he goes on a very angry rant about Family Guy? No, but someone might know about what that is. SpongeBob's going to hell. I think I know what he's talking about. I get nah, nah. I guess you could say SpongeBob's going to rock bottom. <laughs> okay. Okay, I already get the joke immediately. <laughs> Come on, Lucia. Give me strength. Yeah, give me, give me a good level up so we can end this godforsaken chapter. By the way, I have, an, by the way, I have an idea on what I want my next series to be. What? I'm gonna, I'm gonna finally 100% Pac-Man World 2. Why? Cause I've owned that g I've I've owned that game for um I want to say 20 22 years or so, and uh, I've never 100%ed it in my 22 years of playing it. Well, that's just sad. So I want to finally I want to finally give it the 100% it deserves and put it to rest after 22 long years. But did it really took you that long to finish that game? Well, I've been in that game plenty of times, but I've never 100%ed it. Because 100%ing that game is a bitch. Because you have to f you have to get every fruit and every pack dot in every level, 
You also have to do time trials on every single level. That sounds like too much. And you have, to, and, and and you ha and you have to find the eight tokens in every level as well. It's kind of it kind of has like Crash Bandicoot vibes because you know Crash Bandicoot games are kind of hard to hundred percent as well, right? Yeah, I do. I do know what you're talking about because. Well, I mean, there are some exceptions because not all not all of them is meant to be hard, but you know what? I also digress. Yeah. And the and the one thing that you should also digress is trying to find a way to complete everything that happens in Pac-Man World. Yeah. Well, cause I I was gonna. What are the easiest? Uh, what are the easiest Pac-Man World to complete in one hundred percent to you? Mm, well, here's the thing. I've never, I've never um, beaten Pac-Man World One, and I've never really played Pac-Man World Three. <laughs> so two is the only one I have really experienced with. But I do have Pac-Man World Repack on Steam, and I want to play that eventually because I have it bought already. But I was thinking about starting with something I'm more familiar with, so I want to replay World Two. Yeah, I guess you have a point right there. Finally, we're done. But, yeah, we're finally done. All right. Oof, that's just what I needed. Queen Lindsay, are you hurt? Do you feel as alive as I do? This is proof that we need a little chaos. Everyone understands that right now. Yes, but it doesn't make me fond of war. I know we can't stop, but... I understand, Helencia. Your path is important, too. Leave to the rough stuff to me once I get F-Zero-GX on the Switch. Thank you, King... To b uh, uh, Captain Falcon. <laughs> Oh. Who's there? Queen Amelda, you shouldn't be out here all by yourself. It's dangerous. Queen Alencia. Hm. Didn't think anyone in this merry band cared about me. Betrayed by my father, stripped of my power. Now my only son is dead. I have nothing left. Lady Amelda, I'm sorry to impose during this difficult time for you, but can I ask you something? You were King Ashnard's wife, correct? <laughs> Damn, this woman went through a lot in the past two games. <laughs> there was never a formal wedding ceremony, so I suppose someone called me a mistress. Oh, like Romelia? Well, Jacob, well, Jacob you could say that there are so many things that Path of Radiance hasn't explained to us. Yeah. <laughs> she was gonna go. She was gonna get demoted to mid waifu for saying to barn. <laughs> yeah, she almost fucked up. I was the only one he could ever call his wife, and I'm the only one who can be called the mother of his child. Oh, pelvis, to finally have him back after so long. Forgive me for asking, but why did King Ashnard suddenly decided to invade Crimea? I want to know why my parents died. I don't know. The last time I saw Palpatine was long ago, more than 20 years. I'm afraid I don't know many state secrets from after that point. But why? You look so surprised. We had a falling out and ended up living separately. It happens rather a lot, I'm afraid. There is no love between Palpatine and me. There is a strong mutual attraction between us, eventually resulting in a child. But all I ever was to him was a source of power. Once I became pregnant, I was useless to him. Bereft of my strength, he found my presence nothing more than an irritating distraction. After Pelvis was born, Palpatine became obsessed with the boy. But once he realized Pelvis had no special powers, Pal Palpatine rejected him and used him as a bait and a cruel trap for my brother. Lady Amelda. My pelvis, how could you leave me? I'm nothing now. Nothing. Leave me alone now. Just leave me alone. I'm sorry, Lady Amelda. I didn't mean to upset you. Oh, Rajayan, I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Damn, so she's like... As widow as it gets now. Yeah, she's very isolated.
Like, her husband died, her son died, her brother died. That's kind of fucked up. It is. But the thing is, Jacob, is that in my playthrough, like I said, I did spare pelvis. There's an F.E.H. channel? What do you mean by that? So, Jacob, there is... I might get a different script if after I didn't kill pelvis. Mm, okay. Yeah, I might tell you about it later on because I haven't played Radiant Dawn. And like I said, I have played Project Thabes. Eventually, it's still a skill issue. We gotta play the mid brigade again. Oh, wait. Seppi is just telling me about something. At least Sanaki is on our team. The funny Empress Lolly. Yeah, Distortions. Jacob, the Empress Lolly won't be that strong. Oh man. She doesn't even have that much strength to carry a really heavy tome. That's true. Like the one, like the one that she has right now. A FEH channel is equivalent to Fire Emblem Heroes version of a Nintendo Direct. Interesting. Holy shit, it's Lou Albano again. Paisanos, the Dark God tainted minions have defeated our forces at every turn. We won't be able to get the Super Mario Bros. <laughs> Super Show at this point. Actually, Jacob, we will. Jacob, you know what? The Super Mario Bros. Super Show should be the highlight of this <laughs> game. Oh, yeah, that'll, that'll definitely go in there. No, they have set foot on the holy ground of the Empire itself. We have no choice but to lead the army ourselves and destroy them once and for all. We are the chosen ones, my paisanos. Our will is to get the Super Mario Bros. Super Show through the will of the goddess. With us at hand, our army is invincible. And you can't touch me. Uh, yes, quite. As you say, Vice Minister Luobano. And Shovel. My... And you can't <laughs> touch me. You can go to hell. <laughs> my even eat a candy bar. Oh, wait, bar. wrong song. <laughs> when I've beaten that black Sanaki, I'll make her kneel before me and plead for her life. <laughs> and then make her watch the Super Mario Bros. <laughs> Super Show Season 3. <laughs> The Vice Minister says he hears the will of the Goddess, yet I've heard nothing of the kind in my years. Why would the Goddess choose Lou Albano and me? We are the ones with the most to atone for. Well, if anything, I well, if anything, I should have give him, given him the uh, Luigi voice from the Super Show. Mm -hmm. I, think it, I, I think his name was Danny Wells. Yeah, I think so. Empress Sonaki. The silver-haired maiden. Yes, it's me, Midkaya. Um, may I sit next to you? What? Oh, uh... Of course you may. This is awkward. I'm sorry, I know that you're not very fond of me, but I wanted to talk to you. She said thank you. Oh. Well, it was because the text was really fast. It's not that. I like you just fine, it's just that... You make me feel inadequate. <laughs> Maybe Midkaya is inadequate because she's got no speed. She literally doesn't have any speed. <laughs> you can shock my balls. <laughs> What's that song from? I heard you sing it in one of your Mima Light streams. What? That? What the? What the Invincible song? <laughs> is that what you're talking about? It's because I can sing the Gal de Release and hear Yune's voice, isn't it? How did you know? So basically, Sonaki is jealous of Micaiah. Why is she jealous? She has... Actually, maybe she should be jealous, because she also has no speed. She can't double. So that's a, that's um the Mario... The Mario Invincible song. It's like from like 15 years ago or something. It's pretty, pretty iconic. I can sense the flow of people's thoughts. By seeing the movement of a person's mind, I can usually deduce what the person's thinking. Oh, so she's like Satori from Toho, gotcha. You can read minds? What a boon that would be running a country. 
If I could read people's minds, I could tell what the nobles and Senator Armstrongs were thinking behind their smiles. Basically, Sonic e does doesn't have any special attributes that Micaiah has. <laughs> I was thinking of the show Invincible, you know the show with the thank mark meme? Oh. Mm -hmm. I know, I think I know about that meme. I know about that meme as well. Yeah, isn't that where, um... Where... Fucking, I forgot his name. Omni-Man? Yeah, Omni-Man. That's where Omni-Man's from? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I know Omni-Man. I have him in trash. I wonder why the goddess didn't bless me with such power. <laughs> That's a good question. Why didn't Sonic -E didn't get the same power as Micaiah? Yeah, Sonic -E's not mid. Sonic -E's cute. Micaiah's just slow. I thought you loved Micaiah so much. I do. I like to just shit on her because it's funny. Makes sense. Mikaya was born with her power. We didn't give her that power. <laughs> like, um, otherwise if I if I didn't say that, I'd be considered a hypocrite because, you know, I, I like all of that Micaiah beach art on Pixiv, so yeah, I'm not a I'm not a <laughs> I'm not a hypocrite, I swear. Ah, is that you? The Dark... Uh, no, I mean, the Goddess of Chaos, Yune? Let me ask you one thing, Yune. Why was Micaiah able to sing the Galder of Release, but I wasn't? I'm sorry, Little Empress. I don't know. But I knew that Micaiah could sing it. That's be That's why I stayed close to her. I don't understand. How could you be a goddess and not know? I thought gods were perfect beings who know everything. Gods? Perfect? Where did you get that idea? You haven't met a lot of gods, haven't you? Well, no, but divinity created life from nothing. Surely one only surely only perfect beings could do that. We did create life, and can do many things that you creatures of flesh can't. That doesn't make us perfect. It just means we can make mistakes on a much grander scale. Yeah, I feel like Neptunia taught me that pretty well. We're not what you've been taught. And we're much closer to you skin wearers than some will admit. But we do make a lot of mistakes, sometimes even terrible ones. Sometimes, all it takes is one emotional outburst, the entire world is drowning underwater. Yeah, I mean, if you think about it, goddesses are just humans with extremely large, um, responsibilities. Basically, they- basically, goddesses and gods just have- just have powers, but- but if- but if they make one mistake, they'll just, well, you know. Just destroy what's happening on the world. Yep. Basically, Ow. they're just... You could just call them higher humans. Yeah. Where'd this sandstorm come from? Yuna, you need to calm down. I wish we were perfect. Then there wouldn't be any wars. No one would have to die because of our mistakes. Damn, that's a deep line. Yes, I understand, Yune. Now please calm down. Yune? Oh, right, that's me. <laughs> She's gone now. She got upset. She hasn't lost control of her emotions like that in a long time. <laughs> I, guess you could, I guess you could say she had a mood swing. Micaiah, I'm supposed to be the voice of the goddess Ashera. At moments like this, I don't think I'm just in the mood to laugh. Sorry, Jacob. Alright. Yet I've never once heard her speak. I wonder what she's like. We may find out before this is over. This game will be over soon. Yep, soon enough. Alright, let's see if we get more legendary weapons. Bulganon. Oh. And Nosferatu. Nosferatu? <laughs> hey, look, it's Robin's favorite tome. 
Except that it's light magic. Huh. I guess dark magic didn't exist yet, or what? Oh, light magic still exists. It's just that Nosferatu has depicted as a very powerful magic. It's well, basically one of the strongest uh, tomes in the game. Great. We'll be giving that to you, then. If you look at Bulgum, Bul Bulag, none. It's it's basically one of the best fire tomes in the game. Oh, great. You could say it's an alternate to uh, Crime Be Beline. You mean Cymbeline? <laughs> Cymbeline? Sorry, Jacob. I can't even pronounce any words right. Dang it, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right either. That's okay. Oh yeah, we're gonna need to hear the level up noise a lot. Dink. Oh, she didn't get speed. We got the cute bird, we got Nephany. We got um, some useless units, we got Ileana. The Pacholi look-alike. We're going to be hearing that a lot. <laughs> yeah, we are. Wow, okay. Uh, let's see who I should level up more. <laughs> Nutella. Think. Ah, uh, close enough. Hey, close enough. Maybe I'll give the last level up to her. Think. Yeah, that's good. But, wow, I I do have even less characters to level up. Yeah, because it may look like you have a lot of units, but in reality, you only have like a few really good ones that you like. Yeah, like Lara. Yeah. She is literally worth leveling up to. Hmm. Maybe you can give Laura um, Nosferatu. <laughs> I wish I could. I really do. It's just she's barely attacked, so I don't think that's going to be happening. I wish I could get the freaking arm scroll. Mm-hmm. Well, Jacob, I don't think there's much I could do here. I just... <laughs> well, you want to you wanna see my, uh, you want to see my Toho music then? <laughs> And yeah, sure. Let's All take right. a little break. We can take a break to show that off. So, anyways, guys, um, let me just do that real quick. Want to do a five minute break? Yeah, let's do like a five minute break. I'm going to show you my Funi Toho mods. So, okay. yeah. Anyways, um, let me get that booted up. Okay, then. Cause I know you guys are gonna like this shit. Well, I'm sure of it. Mm. Come on, OBS, work with me. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna meet Dolphin temporarily. All right. Well, he, so here's Soku too. Yeah, I'm seeing. Um, I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let you, uh, do the, I'm just gonna let you fight against a computer or something. Okay. Because you're the only one with a controller connected. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sounds like Rainbow Road for some reason. Nah, it's not Rainbow Road. Sounds like it. Did you pause Dolphin? Uh, no, I just have it muted. Well, um, maybe. I, I probably will. I probably should pause it. There we go. So we don't have any miss inputs. Oh yeah, you should probably change your name, by the way. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, two birds. Okay, it's loading. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> is this Toho Mugen? No, this is Soku. Haha, <laughs> Nova Strike! I kinda forgot I had the button input so I turned on. It's like a debug feature. Yeah, so Cerno's theme is now actually Waluigi Stadium. <laughs> or Wario <Wal -Wario> Policy. <laughs> oh my god, this is fantastic. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> it just keeps going. Oh, it doesn't loot properly. <laughs> That's okay. Oh man, I was this close. Oh well. We got two funny birds fighting off against each other. Damn it. So yeah, now every time we pick Cerno's theme, it's gonna play Wario Coliseum. <laughs> so that's pretty great. Oh, it is great. You know, they got all these funny moves that Bird Lady can do. Oh, I know. <laughs> oh god. Oh, you're getting kinda wrecked by Bird Lady. I am. One Come on, bird lady, gotta die from the lasers eventually. Oh shit, she's doing the laser back. There we okay, go. I somehow win. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's still there's still one more. But yeah, next time we play next time we play Soku, I'm probably gonna turn this little button display thing off because it's kind of distracting. <laughs> to look at the any and see if the songs loop properly. Yeah, I've heard of Smash Bros. Crusade. I don't know if it's any good, because I haven't played it. Come on, bird lady, you got this. <laughs> Why is she so OP? <laughs> She's stalling. She's hella stalling, damn. <laughs> yeah, kill her with the Nova Strike. Or the Bird Lady Kick. I wish I could do Nova Strike. I wish I should have killed her with Nova Strike. <laughs> Alright, there's one more there's one more song I need you to pick. So I need I need you to pick um Bloom Bloom Nobly, aka Yuko's theme. Cause I changed okay. her I changed her theme too. 
Oh. Oh shoot! No, no, no! <laughs> the fucking fucking Cernos theme again. <laughs> There's a mod called SMC Plus, and it adds Toho characters. Oh, okay, that might be worth playing then. Okay. No, stop! Bro, you did it again. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, Jacob. You get to uh, trigger half you. <laughs> I know, Jacob. It's just because the loading time is kind of, kind of slow, actually. Yeah. Okay. Now you gotta find a uh, bloom nobly. Where's Bloom? There it is. This is this is Yuko's new theme song. <laughs> I actually have a dumb idea of what you should do. What should I do? <laughs> yeah. Add the friggin' Mega Man X4 theme. What, the Japanese theme? Yeah. Alright, I might I might do that. <laughs> just, for the, just because I'm using Nova Strike specifically. <laughs> okay. But which one should we replace with? Uh, I'll see. I'll see. I mean, you're keeping Bird Lady's theme. Well, Zeppi said re I'm gonna replace it with the uh, Toho 11 version. Okay. Just let him do that because I real just be because I love Bird Lady. You can. <laughs> it's allowed. R Radiant Dawn's done. Oh no, we're taking a little break. I want to show off my Toho mods, my Soku mods. I'm, I'm showing off my new music. Because this new remix of Yuyuko's theme goes hard. <laughs> I killed her with Nova Strike. Wow, the music transition at like the perfect time. Yeah, it is pretty nice. Now you want to play Soku? We'll play Soku. We'll play Soku uh, next week, probably on Sunday if you guys want, instead of uh, trash. Hey, here, here's what we. Here's an idea. Oh, and also, um, for some reason, the game crashes after the music plays for long enough. I don't know what that is all about. I gotta fix that. All right. So I gotta do some troubleshooting on that. So. Be right yeah. back, Jacob. Don't worry. Alright. <laughs> You're eating chips now? Yeah. I'm eating chips right now. <laughs> Alright. Oh, yeah, and Jacob. What? There's something that you should know. What? You should check the map of this chapter because I need to get a specific legendary weapon in this game, in this chapter. Mm, okay. This one is a desert chapter. Basically, it's it's items for all. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think there's going to be a short stream, actually. Was, the stream's yeah. already been going for two hours, so yeah. You may visit again? Huh. Did she say anything interesting to say? Sort of. I think she might be responsible for the ancient flood that sank all of the other continents. Maybe that's why Ashira hates Yune. Hmm. Sorry to break up your alone time, you two, but we have Disciples of Order Troubles again. Hey! That's... 
I knew this would happen eventually. What is it, em Empress Sanaki? Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Little Bono just used the warp staff. <laughs> hey, Paisano Sanaki, the false apostle. What a pleasure to see you again. And this time, I have an army of righteousness <laughs> behind me. Ready to strike you down just so we can get the Super Mario Bros. Super Show! <laughs> or I could use the Warp Staff. Oh my god, I forgot to put that on the soundboard again. I'm stupid. That too. <laughs> Vice Minister Lil Bono, you're the foulest kind of trainer. I can never watch your stupid Super Show. Ha <laughs> I'm amusing. Everybody wants the Super Mario Bros. Super Show Season 3, and even the new season of The Adventures of the Super Mario Bros. 3. <laughs> forgiveness for fraud, just like the people who canceled the show. No forgiveness to anyone that's valuable. Empress Sonicky, don't force me to listen to his blasphemous any longer. <laughs> I'm not silence him for you. Hold, Sigrun. I want to understand. Hello, Bano. On what grounds do you claim that I am not the true Apostle? The Apostle of Bengyon shall be the first-born daughter of each generation in the line of Altina, first Empress. She will give voice to the Goddess. She will pass down judgment and prophecy and will protect her people in their lands. Sonicky, you never once heard the voice of the goddess, have you? That is only... That, that's only because I have not come of age yet. Whoa, what a hysterical coincidence! That's just what the Senate has been telling the people for years! <laughs> Apostle Sonicky is too young to hear the goddess. Give her more time! How funny, is that a lie that you've been living in the same lie we've been telling? But how? Explain yourself, Lil Bono. <laughs> Why does he sound like... Now I sound like Jose. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> this man should stop talking about the Super Show. It was it was that good. It was not... Oh, Zeph, you made another typo. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm saying that the Super... <laughs> the Super <laughs> Show was good. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, the Super Mario Bros. Super Show is that good. It's that good. <laughs> Or false apostle, no one ever told you about the Super Mario Bros. Super Show to your older sister? <laughs> Why didn't your sister tell you about the Super Mario Bros. Super Show? It's a great show! <laughs> Super she Show is hella based. <laughs> that was the reason why the Super Mario Bros. Super Show was famous all over Binyon! I had a sister? She died before you were born, assassinated along with the apostle. What? Messiah. <laughs> Messiah. Me, me, let's we'll just call her Messiah. <laughs> Why don't we call her Misa? <laughs> Misa. <Fuck off. laughs> yeah, yeah, Misa. Fuck off. No, no, no. <laughs> me, me, Misa. <laughs> Misa. <laughs> <laughs> so the Senate installed you. Like, like we installed friggin' music from Toho. Yeah, the custom music that we install in the Toho, uh, friggin' patch or and, whatever and, it and is. So, and Mod Soku too. Yeah, and, 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 <laughs> Misa fuck off. <laughs> Misa fuck off. <laughs> Misa fuck off. The second daughter as the apostle instead. You lie. You and punk both me and the noble herons. <laughs> hey, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm glad to have the, to expose your secret. Perhaps now you will be able to accept the truth. Silence. The lying tongue of the treacherous senator proves nothing. You seek proof. Fine, we shall settle this in Smash! 
You should add that to your soundboard, Jacob. Settle this in Smash? <laughs> yeah. Where's Settle it in Smash! Where's that from? The commercial from oh. Super Smash Bros. for 3DS. Okay. <laughs> I'll, give a, I'll give it a link to you if you want. Yeah, sure, that would help. Okay. What time are we at? We're at two hours exactly, so... Yeah, we'll see. I mean, I, I got another hour or so. do not you just yeah, hate it when you're watching a Twitch stream and gets interrupted by not one, but three ads? Yeah, it happens. I mean, I toned down the ads. They were pretty bad before, because Twitch, is, Twitch likes to spam them. I had to tone them down. Okay. I found it, Jacob. Even, okay. though all, even though all of it is in commercial, so try five seconds. Okay. Oh. Hey, Alice. Ooh, I like me some Alice. Hand over the pizza. Hand over the pizza. No! no. Settle it! Smash! <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's a good... Yeah, it's a good voice line, huh? Settle it in Smash! Wow, um, Xander Mobus' is... announcer voice can actually sound good. Crazy. Yes. <laughs> Tone it down to no ads. Well, then what was the point of becoming affiliated then? <laughs> Who cares? You got an ad for Kraft Mac and Cheese. Oh, yeah, hell yeah. Kraft Dinner? Kraft Dinner is where it's at, man. You know, good. Whomever the goddess sees fit to win the day, we must be fighting just so we could get season three. And I love how he used the warp stab just to go back to his position. What an right. absolute power move. Captain Lou, we finally found you. Now's our chance, South. We must do whatever it takes to get the blood packed. Right, let's, let's go. go. Let's go. <laughs> we just said it in sync. <laughs> in sync. Settle it in sync. Okay, that's a good one. Well, wow, I literally have so many good... Hey, get rid of Edward. We don't need him. Okay. <laughs> Maybe the old man can stay. Mm. Nolan. Nolan is good, I Nolan's guess. Nolan's good. No, nope, this team's good. We just, don't need, we just don't need Edward. He's lame. Yeah, we don't need Eduardo. Yeah, Eduardo. Alright, well, I'm prepared to be here until midnight. <laughs> if I have All right, to. Alright, Jacob, just... Just try to find the map of this chapter. It's part part four, three for the items. All right. Let's see. Um. Well, it says there's a there's a guy called Stefan. And he has a vague caddy. Is that the weapon you're looking for? What do you mean? Who has the vague caddy? Some guy called Stefan. Oh, that's the freaking boss unit. Oh. <laughs> I didn't realize. I thought the boss was Lil' Bono. No. Okay. Um... Item data. Is it the base lard? Yeah, I'm trying to find the base lard. It says, Hidden treasure. Near the center of the map, one space north of the rightmost of the three swordmasters. That is the one weapon that I need to try to find. Okay, so you gotta find where there's the part... You gotta find a part where there's three swordmasters, and you gotta go, like, around there. Apparently. Okay, I can try to do that. Wow, Tanith literally has no weapons. So I think it's best for me to get get weapons from her. Yep. Maybe I'll get another wind edge. <laughs> well, I don't need... Edward doesn't need any of this shit. <laughs> and I got the Tempest Blade. What the hell is the Khaled Bolg? <laughs> I have no idea, but nor do I care. I'll look it up. Ooh, yeah, Khaled Bulg, Radiant Dawn. Um, I 
What does it do? Oh, only, only, um... Can only Edward wield it? Yeah, I, I guess so. Uh, it has 15 might. And it gives you plus 8 luck when equipped. Hmm. I think, yeah, I think he's the only one who can actually wield it, so whatever. That's, uh, never mind that. Right, let's get started. Alright, I want to see where those three sword masters are. Um, are those the three sword masters? No, I don't think so. No. Those are, like, two sword masters. Well, where's the, se the where's the center of the map? Are those the three sword masters in that line there? There's a steel bow, so no. No, right there. Yeah. You see the three sword masters? I think those are the three sword masters right there. So it's around there. It's in the middle of the map there. Yeah, I see it. So apparently if you go around there, you can find it. So that kind of narrows it down. It's in the center of the map. We know that. Oh. Hopefully we'll finish this chapter quickly. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. I'm just kind of bummed out that the game kept crash. I kept kind of bummed out that Soku kept keeps crashing. Maybe we waste enough time by playing Soku. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, okay. Zeppi sent more good sauce. So we got um. <laughs> yes, the Smash commercial. Um, we got Lindis and Boonie Mithra. So I like I like what I'm seeing. That's some some pretty good sauce right there. Oh god, that is hot. <laughs> and he also sent me some good sauce. More good sauce. Yeah, he sent me more of it. I won't complain about more good sauce. Even if I'll be up later tonight. I feel like Sigrun is going to be the slowest Pegasus knight. I have a funny idea for the Lagoos transforming. What? What was that? So yeah, you want to have that area highlighted, it looks like. I mean, this map doesn't look too big. There's just a crap ton of units, that's all. Oh, I know that. I mean, the ones that are going to carry through the map is probably like the flyers. Mm-hmm. Each bird, when they transform, they should have the bird, the bird up sound. Bird up. I, mean, no, I, I like that idea. I mean, I could just do that. Um, I could just do that, um... Like... So since there's not many there's not many chapters, I can just do that like manually. Yeah, here comes the funny bird. It's like what are we on? We're on like chapter three, I think. Yeah, this is chapter this is chapter three of section four. So we're close to we're close to the tower, by the way. Yeah, so then in the next stream, we will get through all of the chapters, and then we'll get to- we'll, we'll start end game the episode after that. And yeah, I, we're I, gonna I, I don't know, who, who knows how long that's gonna take. <laughs> well, like I said, things are gonna get really bad. Ooh, mages- Ooh, I think the mages can go further. Hmm. Maybe I could use this to my advantage. Well, anyway, we get to listen to the Devoted again, so that's good. Yeah, he, it's good that you fix it, by the way. <laughs> yeah, quote-unquote fixed. You know, Jacob, I'm proud of you. Hooray! Yeah. Yeah, for what, for what, for once, for, for the record, it, it's not that I quote unquote fixed it. It's that I just replaced the Dawn Brigade metal theme with the Devoted. That's all I did. It, it was pretty easy. I literally just copy and pasted the 
the devoted and renamed it and then it worked <laughs> that's, wow, all even, I, that's all i did even, jacob even micaiah is gonna is gonna do so much more yeah it's like that song i forgot it's like that song from sonic where it's like so much more or whatever yeah i think i know what you're talking about <laughs> yeah i'm surprised you remember that song yeah i'm also surprised i remember that song but yeah, literally, Micaiah can can literally move even further. You feel like you feel like doing so because you're playing with Jose lately. Yeah. Um. Well, if I want to play Soku again, I gotta fix that. I gotta fix the fucking game from crashing when it plays Yuko's theme because I don't know why the fuck it did that. I tested it out earlier and I assumed that like it was breaking because I set the loop point wrong. But no, I set the loop point correctly and it's still crashing. I don't know why. Is it possible to assume that the only reason why Zeppi is playing Soka with me is because that I'm literally free every day? I mean, yeah. I'm just, I'm just assuming. Uh, I'm not saying if if it's true. <laughs> it's this fuck is the Numa Numa guy. <laughs> Why does, why does his face look small? <laughs> it's the guy with the KFC bucket on his head. Well, Vice Minister Lacane, I take it we may begin. I actually. I mean, I mean, Lou Albano. Sorry. <laughs> that guy looks ugly. He's funny though. He's 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 the part three thumbnail. Okay. Jacob, I have an idea. What? Uh. Hello, Mario. Yeah. Hello, Mario. You can be wrong. I. No, I cannot. <laughs> I think your internet's dying. <laughs> Listen! Okay, I'm listening. What do you want okay, me to listen to? Thank God you can hear me. I want you to give this guy a voice of the freaking Luigi from the Super Show. Yeah, that's what I'm trying. That's what I'm trying to do. Okay. My mic was dying, right? Yeah, it was cutting you out. Yeah, I'm sorry. It does happen sometimes when my internet is cutting off. Yeah, at, least, at, least, at least better than Marquis's internet was yesterday. <laughs> he kept lagging a fuck time when okay. we were playing Soku. The champions of the goddess, crush these heretics. Oh god, I've heard enough about fucking heretics in Neptunia. Let me have a break. Why? <laughs> they kept talk. That's like the entire plot of like the first Neptunia. They keep talking about the fucking heretics. <laughs> Give them a reward. Oh shit! Now I won't even know. The only, the only thing I, the only thing I'm tr I'm trying to quote oh, from. Oh Oh nice. The only thing I remember about Luigi in the Super Show is where he says, Me, but I can't. I'm gonna have a baby. <laughs> okay, that's something I can remember. <laughs> Jose, is, Jose and Zeppi are free every day. Well, good for you guys. I'm, I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm free every day, but I just don't want to play Soku every day because I'm gonna get bored of it. Oh shit, she, ha she, she has Corona. I don't think it says Corona. Yeah, it did. No, it doesn't. It really doesn't say that. Zeppi, it said Corona. Tell, tell him. <laughs> Nutella has Vantage Plus. I'm trying to think of a Super Show quote besides, you mean I wasted my tomato sauce? I don't remember that. I don't remember that quote. Oh, I mean, what, what is he doing? What, is he? Okay. Was that what I think it is? Okay. Who 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 had the staff? Who? L sleep. <laughs> Is that the guy? The f five turns. Five turns oh. of sleep. L silence. Oh my god. What name? I only know that quote because it was in a Doug Doug video. I don't know who Doug Doug is, but I'm sure he's great. So much <laughs> there he is. <laughs> I can't even find anyone who has the vague Cotty. Um. Well, apparently, 
No, hang on. I'll try to find it. I'm not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up. Come on. Uh, it says, have Micaiah move on to the space column 21, row 13, just north of a sniper who is the lone enemy on the rightmost column. To the right? Mm, the lone sniper, it says. So, that, a bit more down. That guy, probably right there. It says, it says north, north, one space north of that sniper. And you have to specifically have Micaiah step on that space. So Micaiah? Yeah. So, so would Micaiah have to specifically get the freaking legendary knife as well? I think so, yeah. Oh god. This is not going to be a fun chapter to be collecting items. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, I kind of want to go shower, but I don't so know is if this... now's a good time. <laughs> Nope. I'd probably put her into a death trap. Hmm. Is this... Is this it? Nope. Fuck. I'm gonna be here all day, you know? Oh, would you guys be mad if I went to go shower in the middle of stream? <laughs> you know what? Sure, you can do that. Because, uh... Want to. I'm, I don't know. My, my hair is kind of getting all oily, and I, I don't feel very comfortable, so I kind of want to go shower. So, so you're might... saying it's all... So you're saying it's all kind of poofy, right? Well, it's always poofy, but, like, I kind of want to... I don't know, I've been wanting to shower, and I would like to shower before it's midnight, so I might just do that in the middle of the stream, and then I'll be, you know, all refreshed and stuff, and then I can continue to do the rest of this chapter. So, I hope you don't mind me stepping away for, like, 15 minutes or so. Yeah. If that's fine. You can, you can just hear me talk. Mm, well... If, if, that's, it's a, if that's okay... Um, you can, you can tell me what happens when I get back. I gotta, I'm gonna go. So, I'll be back, guys. I'll see you a little bit. You guys can let me know how Jose is doing on the chapter when I get back. So, yeah. Uh, I don't, okay. I don't, I don't shower midstream very often. I've only done it, like, one other time, but, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be back. Ooh. <laughs> I got it. Oh, thank you. I wish I could see the entire map. How should I go to the map again? Oh, well, it doesn't matter anyways. Well, I it seems to me that I can't even find the base lard. How about if I go this way?
Well, I can't even kill. Okay, I hope this works. Oh my goodness, this is so good! Yo! Okay, and now I am happy. I am this happy. Sheeta! Sheeta, my favorite! Sheeta! Thank you so much, Zeppi. Even though, unfortunately, I'm kind of having a tough time. Okay, that's a good idea. Like I said, I'm gonna have a tough time right now because I really need to find specific weapons. Yeah. Oh yeah, I actually did saw I actually did saw what happened in FEH as well. Yeah, I saw it. There are new characters that I'm familiar with. There's Nephany. The who, who else do I remember the most? And uh Even though it's the Path of Radiance version of Nephany. There's Mia, there's Lucia. Literally a good roster, I will say this much. If anybody knows what I'm talking about, me and Zeppi have watched a new... Me and Zeppi just watched a new video of FEH, Fire Emblem Heroes. It's... it's a game that we enjoy.
Come on, Laura. Give me magic. Yes. Hell yes. And it's and it's gone. It and the friggin' light tome is gone. Oh, this is gonna take a while. Why not? Just played it for the announcement. Oh, okay. Yeah, I get what you're talking about. The rates can be really unfair just because you can't get the specific unit you want. This can't be happening! Oh, no! No! What? Why? Why? Come on, miss! I hate bow guns. For once, why can't you miss? Like that. Why does this keep happening? Why? 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 Why is this happening? Why? I am so upset. Why? Just why? No, no, no. I... I hate this. I hate this game. That shouldn't always hit. That really shouldn't. Oh, thank God! Ooh. Thank God! I hate it when that happens. That- that is literally the ironic thing that I'm thinking of. A 69 hit rate, that is so ironic. Well, Marcia, I'm not going to bring you along in the final tower. I'm sorry, but I can't. I really can't.
Oh, oh. Oh, no. Okay, that killing edge didn't do shit. Well, neither is my hit rate. Word of advice, never become reckless. If, if only you got more speed. If, if only you did. Okay, stun! Oh crap. Stuff like this literally scares me. I'm always getting lucky. Always. Fell asleep. Okay, you know what? That's a good thing, because you wasted most of your staffs. Good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Nutella. Didn't have to go friggin' berserk. Is Ileana really that slow? <laughs> yeah, fair point. But, but the thing is that sometimes the hit rates do land. Sometimes it's... It's kind of out of the question when you think about it. Okay, good. Good. She she leveled up tomes. Cool. Cool. Well, again, good. Good enough reason. Oh, that's crazy damage. I mean, I will say this once, the one game that actually portrays the hit rates perfectly well is Genealogy. Because the hit rates in that game is very accurate. Come on, Tanith. Give me speed. You're not in the need for speed! You, why aren't you in the mood for a need for speed? Just why? Yes, I got it! Oh, 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 oh crap. Oh no, <laughs> I'm in a bad situation. I am going to get jumped. I am going to get freaking jumped. Unless... Alright, I'm finally back. Jacob, I finally found it. You found the weapon? 
I finally found the base lord. Ooh, SS Ultimate Dagger. I am giving this to friggin' Here, let me Heather. Turn my, let me turn my camera back on. There we go. We have a Jacob, a lot of things has happened when you left. Alright, well, you can tell me what happened now. So what happened is that friggin' Tanith actually died by a bow gun. You revived her, right? No. No? I mean, I had to use so many save states just to... Just to ensure her safety. So Tanith is just gone. Yeah. Well, I hope it was worth it so we can get that, uh... That, uh, that ultimate dagger. Wait, Tanith is right there. What do you mean? <laughs> well, you should check the clips. I don't see any clips. She died to a 69%. Well, that's pretty yep. lame. Yeah, by a freaking bow gun. Do you find that ironic? No, that's, that's just dumb. <laughs> I literally got this angry. <laughs> I literally said, fuck! <laughs> okay, send me that clip later then. <laughs> it's literally what I... <laughs> Cause that that would make for a good uh, that make for a good clip if um that if that's there. Okay, we're getting somewhere. <laughs> a male with a bow gun. Well, I'm glad I took my shower midstream instead of after stream because I feel a lot better now. So, so it was freaking Micaiah that I had to use. What were you trying to do? <laughs> I'm trying to go to specific. Uh, I have to go to specific lands just to get the freaking weapons. Well, there's only one weapon on this map as far as I'm concerned. And there's also the light gem. The light so gem? Probably... Yeah. I'll see where that is. Part 3, chap or part 4, chapter 3. Let's see, chapter data. So where's the light gem at? Are you talking about the white gem? Yeah. In a natural corner made by the southwestern cliffs. So, so where am I pointing right now? That's right. Pretty much, yeah. It's, it, actually, it's, it's Yeah, it says in the corner. So are there other legendary weapons that I have to worry about in this in this chapter? Um there's something called the Dragon Foe. I don't know what that does, though. I'm trying to find it. Oh, wait. I think I know where the Dragon Foe is. Dragon Foe. Um, when equipped, all the user's attacks become effective against Dragon Lagoos. That actually sounds like a really good skill. So that says in a natural in a natural corner made by the center north cliffs. I feel like I have to bring Micaiah over there. It can be done with anybody. It doesn't have to be Micaiah. Micaiah is only needed for that base lard. The base lard, huh? Yeah. You can also find you can also find a shine tome from the enemy bishop. I really hope she survives. Cause that 10% uh friggin' crit doesn't look good. But wow, Thorn literally does a crazy amount of damage. Oh, oh shoot, he's oh, is, it, is, it, is it this guy? Uh oh. Oh no, he's gonna double. Why? Why? Wow, Taz is getting bullied in this map. I can't I can't do anything. Oh no. It I, I can't even do anything. What the fuck? <laughs> fuck Tanis. 
I literally can't. Well, the only, the only the only thing I think you'd be able to get through with that is if they if they miss the seventy four percent chance. That's less likely gonna happen, Jacob. Hmm. He literally can't do anything. Oh man. Yeah, we know this guy. If one of the attacks miss, I'd be happy. Nope. <laughs> why? Why does this keep happening? I don't want Tana to die! Well... <laughs> her first death? No. This isn't the first death, technically. We had, uh, we had Marcia's brother die, but we didn't care about him, so... Yeah. I also, want, I also don't want Tana to die. Yeah. Maybe this could work. Hopefully. Maybe. Mm, no, it looks the same to me. <laughs> that doesn't count. <laughs> oh my god, they are not even that fun! <laughs> so you're calling Tanith? Yeah, I guess Tanith is the first because she's the she's one of the only units we care about. But the problem is that I'm literally carrying Micaiah. That's the problem. Yeah, and that's why she's getting doubled, right? Yeah. Hmm. She better miss. There. Oh, there thank go. God. I knew I knew he was gonna miss the moment I saw um the moment Oh I, no. Oh wait. The moment I saw that the moment I saw that guy get hit by Tanith, that's how I knew um he was gonna miss. <laughs> Definitely gonna wanna heal. <laughs> I know. I'm just i I'm just kinda bothered on how I'm gonna fix the Toho music. <laughs> But I guess I have all of tomorrow to figure that out. Yeah, hopefully. Even though I would like to do it tonight, but... I don't know. <laughs> so, who... Okay. Like, low-key, I'm kind of tempted... Like, I kind of just... Like, if it were up to me, I would just say, do a battle save and we continue this chapter next time, because... <laughs> It's getting really late for me. I still want to finish this chapter, though. Yeah, but I don't know how long it's going to take. <laughs> we'll finish it eventually, Jacob. I'm sure we will. How about this? We'll start the chapter after we save. Hmm. What do you think about this? Because we're, we're at, like, the three-hour mark, so... <laughs> we're at the three-hour mark, almost. Big up, I'll try to finish this quickly. Mm, well... I'll just put it this way. If we don't get the... If we if the chapter isn't finished by midnight, then, uh... <laughs> I'm not gonna be in the best mood. Okay, then midnight it is. Yeah. But I'd like to go to bed by midnight. I know. I know. Then again, I guess it is kind of on me for doing Radiant Dawn so late, but... Not much I can do about that. <laughs> you see, you can play Bird Lady on Soku. <laughs> sure, yeah, we go with that. Alright, ooh, that's a good level up. All right, hey, yeah. guess, all right, hey, guess what, guys? We got some more bird lady sauce. Okay, let me see. Bird. 
<laughs> Bird booba. I mean, Jacob, it was kind of your fault that we did play Soku for a little bit. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I did. I really just wanted to show off my mods. It was really hard not to. I guess, yeah, it is one in the morning for you, I know. But I'm not, like, accustomed to staying up late like you guys. Because, like, I if I if it's any later than, like, 1 in the morning, I just, like, can't function. Because <laughs> I'm kind of a morning person, honestly. Sound like, sound like my parents, actually. Oh, boo, boo, don't compare me to parents. They literally wake up in the morning, so... Hey, there you found there the dragon is. foe. There it is, dragon foe. Wait, why does it say dragon slayer now? <laughs> I hey, you, know, you know what to do. Da na 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 which version? Which version is it that has the fart music? I think it's the 32x version. <laughs> yeah, it is the 32x one. Hang on, hang on. Give me, give me, give me a second, guys. I know, I know, I'm dragging on the stream, but I can't help it. I gotta play this. It's really funny. You hate being up late. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> uh, if you guys haven't listened to this before, it's fucking great. I probably have listened to it during. It's the fart. Have... It's the fart version. I actually have listened to this theme from <laughs> the Angry Video Game Nerd <laughs> when he was doing his Doom episode. Yeah, that's what. That's what it is. <laughs> okay, that's enough. There you go. That was worth it. That was a, that was a, that was funny. Oh, it was. Yeah, the fucking fart version of the Doom theme. <laughs> now that was good. The <laughs> farting bees. <laughs> I love how we just call it the farting bees now. Yeah, we do these streams. Okay, well, hear me out, right? I was I was spending some quality time with my girlfriend, and we were just watching shit together. And then before I knew it, it was like you know 8 p.m. And I'm like, well, uh, now I now I'm finally ready to do Radiant Dawn since you know we're done watching. And, you know, it was like it was like 10 p.m. for Jose when we started, so yeah. Hey, he got strength. And since these Radiant Dawn streams tend to last for like three hours, what were we watching? Uh, we were just watching like random YouTube videos. Yeah, we were. No, not you. You're not included. <laughs> Shut up, Jacob. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Hey, <laughs> yo, it's the man! The golden stripling! My maiden, holding up a little longer, I'm here. Thank you, thank you, Wanward. Past night, you're here to save the day. Alright, Jacob. Now we can finally... F now we can finally go through this chapter pretty quickly since he's here. Fuck yeah, you should have been here like two turns ago. Now it's time to heal Tanith. Or whatever turn it is, I don't know what turn we're on. Dink. Oh turn shit! Five, yeah. She levels up staff! Nice. You know what that means, right? What? She can carry the Ashera staff. And what does that do? It heals everything oh, from shit. stat to HP. Literally every penalty. Oh, that's great. Mm hmm. Literally the best staff in the entire game. <laughs> MPID Knight? Is that a typo, Zeppi? MPID Knight. Oh, no, no, I mean... oh. Is that, a fuck is that the fucking, like, typo from Path of Radiance? Where for some reason he was called MPID Knight. I forgot all about that. Yes, it's that one. <laughs> I still don't know why he was called that. <laughs> it was, I think it was intended to be a typo. 
There's no way that was intentional. That, that, that was funny, though. It was. Wow. Is he actually called MPAD Knight right now, though? I guess so, yeah. No, check, check him. Okay, I'll do that later once I finish this chapter. Well, I mean, he's right there, though. <laughs> you can just check his stats or whatever. Alright, he's not called MPID Knight, sad. Would be funny. He does have concoctions, though. I mean, why does, why does he need conco concoctions? I don't know. Now I want to go back to that Path of Radiance stream and see MPID Knight. <laughs> why is Black Knight a green unit? Fuck if I know. Yeah, I don't know either. He felt like being green today. Yeah, exactly. He, he's trying to he's trying to be special. <laughs> Whatever that means. Yeah, and no, I'm not saying he's retarded. I know, but <laughs> why special specifically? Well, he wants to stand out, so he's a green unit. Fair point. Now, if you wanted to, if you wanted to really stand out. He'd break all of the rules and be a purple unit. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. That's the point. <laughs> and, and your point still stands as to why? Purple units aren't real. <laughs> I know. Mm, I don't get the green unit reference. What is that a reference to? This guy, this oh. guy, this guy feels like he's one of us. So, I approve. He is one of us, I will say this much. Well, and Marissa's here, too. With her ass attack. You're, you're horny with the ass attack. <laughs> yes! Tried. There he goes. <laughs> he okay. Just, he just says fuck you. Yeah, the Black Knight is literally going to destroy. Why, why can't you go for the Black Knight? He's waiting for you. You sent Funi meme? <laughs> Funi. Okay, I'll have a look. <laughs> Hold on. Take a look at this. <laughs> <laughs> he actually. <laughs> he actually did send me this image before. That's pretty great. I might, <laughs> I might have to save that. Good, you should save that. Honestly, I think th I think it's this game. This game is the reason why the Black Knight is an ultimate as an assist trophy. Yeah, that's probably the reason why. Oh wow, you got. <laughs> He got Bane, he too. Got Bane? Cool. Too bad he did it the wrong time. He did it in the wrong order. You're st what are you, what are you, stupid, South? Hey, what are you, stupid? <laughs> oh, so both... So both Go Gohan is just... It's just less powerful. That's good to know. And Cymbeline? Yeah. I mean, Cymbeline is, you know, Sanaki's signature tome. So Lillian is supposed to be stronger than Belong going or something like that. You know, I'm just gonna call it Baloney, because uh, that sounds that sounds better. Yeah. Basically Baloney is kinda weaker. <laughs> Baloney or Bolognese or whatever it's called, you know, like the, the pasta. With the pasta Maybe. sauce. Maybe, but not entirely. <laughs> yes, sure. I, yes, I have Edelgard, you're a fucking idiot on my soundboard. I love that sound. You have the new flare. Flare again. Yeah, that video's great. <laughs> the MVID knight is the president of Burger King. He is the king of Burger King. <laughs> He's the king of burgers. From the king of burgers. Wait, does that mean that Black Knight is gonna play Big Bumpin? <laughs> yeah, he's gonna play Big Bumpin. <laughs> Wait a minute. Maybe I can get an maybe I can get an Xbox emulator so I can play Big Bump in. <laughs> Good idea. Fire on three houses if it was written by Vivzy Pop? Whoever that is. I don't know. Oh, there's Corona. 
Oh, so it really is called Corona. What the heck? Yeah. Too bad it didn't kill. Oh, they created Tasman Hotel and Hello Boss? That's probably why I don't know them, because I don't really care for those series. Oh. <laughs> she did? It's expected that she maxes out luck. Where the hell have I been these all, all these years when they made a spirit when they made another thing like Hasman Hotel? And Jacob. I don't think Nephany's gonna do anything in this chapter. Yeah, she doesn't really need to. <laughs> don't watch them. Hell of a but boss you know has the person who voices Futaba. Yeah, well, Erica, she voices a crap ton of characters, though. But you know what you should watch? What? I Don't mean, Stop Believing My Journey. <laughs> yes. I mean, Erica, Erica Lindbeck voices uh, Uzume in Neptunia, so, yeah. Hmm, reinforcements? I suppose I turn my back to my own safety. It is vital that I will not be harmed for the good of the world to come. While it pains me to leave the field of battle, I mustn't put myself at risk. The character she voices in the show is a furry. Oh, even worse. This <laughs> It's hell of a man. Oh shit. Oh shit, here comes the Numa Numa guy. I don't understand. Why would they fight against the Vice Minister, chosen of Ashera? Are they somehow deficient? You will perish for your defiance of the Empire, Vermin. Oh, Vermin? Like the like those bosses in um, Neptune? Oh, Six damage. That, 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 that is a good amount of damage, right, Jacob? Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, here comes more people using the warp staff. Eight reinforcements. Okay, I'll try to finish this chapter quickly. Reinforcements? This is more like reinforce skin. Am I right? <laughs> yeah, maybe. Come on, bird up. Bird up. Bird up. We really don't need oh. reinforcements. Yo, you got a cock. Get it? Because you're a bird? <laughs> yes, I get it. If Gale Force was in this game, it would go by so much quicker. Are you talking about the are you talking about the TTYD Gale Force? Because that would be great. I could just blow all the enemies away in like one turn. <laughs> you know we're not talking about that kind of Gale Force. Oh man. I mean they were I mean both games were made by intelligence systems, so they probably got some inspiration. You're the inspiration. Banger music. <laughs> what do you mean, banger music? Come on, the vote is good. Damn yeah. it, damn it, Ileana, you need two more experience. It's okay, I'm saving the experience. See, I, w I wish we had Flurry's Gale Force from TTYD, because then I could just blow all of the enemies away. Gale Force gives you another turn. Oh, so it's kind of like Rally Wink, then. Jacob, I don't think it would be fun to blow all out all the enemies. Because that wouldn't even make a fun game. It would just be boring as hell. I mean, not all the enemies. You just blow away the enemies when you're getting sick of the enemies, you know? <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean, you know what? Gale, 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 Gale Force kind of like the press turn system in SMT. <laughs> I mean, look at Laura. She's actually close to maxing out her magic. Good on her. I don't think... I mean, the one that I might even think about leveling her up is probably, like, res or defense. Yeah, she definitely needs some more res. Yeah, she is probably the low... She is probably the lowest mage to get defense. She's the Rizzler. Like the Riddler. <laughs> the Riddler. Like Ridley. <laughs> <laughs> I get where you're coming from. He's too fucking big for Smash. Remember Ridley hits the big time? <laughs> Ridley hits the big time. We ranked we ranked Ridley's trailer pretty high because of that. Yeah, because in the trailer, I'm sure people expected Ridley to be there. And I I, I was quoting um I was quoting Etika's reaction where he was like, he killed Samus. <laughs> oh, I, yeah. I, st I still I still quote Etika to this day, because he still got some funny ass lines. Still missing though. Yeah. 
But his fuck his fucking smash ultimate reaction is still godlike. His legacy will live on. Yep, like legacy of Lunatic Kingdom. We'll get to that game, by the way. <laughs> yeah, that's where Mommy Junko is from, if anybody didn't know. Yeah, six damage. I like that output. Yeah, and one more experience. So that means the next time an enemy misses Ileana, she's gonna level up. I wish I could level up by dodging. Oh. Oh, great. More reinforcements. Hey, he's finally not sleeping anymore, you lazy fuck. Skipper, you finally woke up. Oh, look. A button. <laughs> Which Junko? Yeah, that one. Yeah, he has Mommy Junko. Yeah, the one that loves Boonni. He does. I mean, there's a lot of Junkos, aren't there? <laughs> Yeah, but the one that I'm going for is... Oh. oh. The one that I'm going for is the one from Lunatic Kingdom. Yep. Lol. Nice job. Nice job, Wyvern. You, you missed. Dumb Wyvern. Ah. Anybody has bow? Bows? All oh, crossbow? No bows? <laughs> well, eventually we'll eventually we'll get to kill um Lil Bono. <laughs> Sounds really bad out of context, but trust me, it, ma it matters. It matters with context. Flare. Now she's gonna heal up. Oh, so it's like soul, but for um but mages. For, but for mages, cool. Yeah, AJM. she got she got magic. AJM, you won't believe her speed. Holy, Holy shit! shit. <laughs> yep, she, she maxes out speed. Wow, good on her. Now she's faster than Mikayo. Even though she, even though her speed is kind of low. Well, still better than mid Kaya, slow Kaya, her and her <laughs> slow packed. <laughs> Fucking slow Kaya. Yep. Hmm. The problem is that I have to deal with these freaking wyverns. I'm not sure if she's gonna survive with the wyverns. Just uh, just throw the black knight at them. That'll solve your problems. Uh oh. Well, I don't think that's gonna matter. Okay. <laughs> Thank God. Oh, Duke Numa Numa. Unbelievable that a coward like you was changed back from stone. Particularly surprising given some of your more impious transgressions. Well, I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm a senator in good standing. My country produces excellent spies, your grace. I know every atrocity you committed while in Dane. I actually held quite a bit of incriminating evidence that would destroy you if it made public. It's a pity that all that work will be wasted, though, since this is the last day of your life. Damn, he's fucking awesome. <laughs> he's even more awesome when he missed. They're going for it. Dude, Nutella's, <laughs> dude, Nutella's fucking badass. That, that line went hard, holy shit. <laughs> Context yeah, or not, I can't wait to see this super show loving motherfucker guy. <laughs> <laughs> this super show loving motherfucker. That's a good ass, uh, that's a good ass line too. Okay, that is a good ass line. <laughs> <laughs> super show ass motherfucker. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> He'll be gone eventually. Mm. You know what? I think now might be a good time to open my window. I'll give it a try. Oh, I can't believe Eliana is safe. I think it's because they're afraid that she has thunder. 
thunder. Two can thunder. Oh great! I opened my window at a fucking terrible time. Apparently. Sorry, Jacob. Because <laughs> now there's a fucking plane out there. Oh, I always do that. I always somehow manage to open my window when there's like a lot of noise out there. Whatever. I don't care. I want that cold air, man. So it's, it's good. Well, we have more reinforcements, at least. At least she'll do something about it. I'm just gonna be glad when it's when summer's over and I can go back to having cold nights. We're gonna we're gonna go to the autumn season. Just wait, Jacob. Yeah, autumn will be good. You'll just feel the breeze air. Yeah, like spring breeze from Kirby. Yeah, yeah, like spring breeze. I found out that Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland has four-player, multiplayer co-op in it. Which is pretty wow. nice. Wow, okay. Can't do that much damage. If only Nutella was really this far in range. Well, at least Nutella can take out one of these guys. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you don't have to remind me about it. Oof. Oh no. Oof. I I'm I'm kind of in a bad situation. Oh well. Well, that, that should be good. Alright, Ileana, you get to dance again. Oh my god, this is so good! Yes! Heck freaking yes! Dink. Oh, oh well. Guess she'll hold off the magic, I guess. I guess she needs a few more levels. Wasn't there another weapon you need to get in this chapter? No, it's just the just the dagger. Now I have to worry about the friggin' crossbow. Yeah. So what was the item that I was gonna go for? Oh yeah, that's right. Well, I know there's a white gem in some part of this map. In the southwest of the map, yeah. It's around where that cliff is that you're next to. Huh, so it wasn't there. I don't really know I don't really know what it means by southwestern corner or something. It's weird. I'm not sure what it means. But I guess you'll find it if you just keep hunting around that cliff. She better get flare. Nah, she don't nope. need flare. Wow, two damage. How threatening. Definitely. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, never mind. She's fine. I got scared until I saw the 37% hit rate. <laughs> yeah, she is pretty frail, I will say. As frail as slow Kaya. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so let's, let's go around this cliff and see if we can find that white gem. We get to listen to the Devoted some more, because that's always nice. You know, honest, on, on, honestly, if Mikaya was more like she is in Engage, I'd probably like her a little bit more in this game. <laughs> and why is that? Because, I don't know, I, lo I just like her, you know, very mother-like personality in Engage. That's, 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 a, it's, that's a rare case where I can actually say that I think Engage did something better. <laughs> How do you think she's portrayed over here? 
Um, I don't know, in this game, she just feels, like, really helpless, and it barely feels like she does anything in this game, honestly. People call her the Mary Sue in this game. Yeah. Uh, I feel like it's more to the left. Where's the left? Well, it says it's around where that cliff is, so I feel like I, I feel like try, try going to the left, maybe. Like here? Yeah, or maybe where that sword master is standing. Nope. I don't know. You'll you'll find it eventually. <laughs> it's gonna take a while, but no oh well. I feel like I, I feel like it's where that that sword master is then. I know this is gonna be annoying, but still, I want to get more money. More money. <laughs> like money. <laughs> Jose, the fuck do you mean? Where's the left? There it is. Okay. Oh. Okay, I guess I was wrong. It was right there, apparently. Weird. Makaya. So Makaya wasn't even needed. No, y you can get it with anybody. Like I said, you only need for... Makaya for the dagger. Wow, Makaya's really this frail, huh? But you know what, Jacob? There's something that I might regret doing. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. good! Nice. Now she can use Nosferatu. Wow, finally. Took her long enough. But I can't waste Nosferatu just yet. Oh, CMU got updated. And how is it? Oh, let's find out. CMU, the Wii U emulator, went open source more than a year ago and is now getting regular updates on GitHub. The latest version was released this week and is available for Windows, Mac, and Linux. It's good to see emulators such as CMU are apparently spared from Nintendo's wrath and they don't have all to all the they all, all have to follow Switch emulator Yuzu's fate. Yeah. You know, Jacob, I think the I think Nintendo really hates the the freaking Wii U. That might be why they're not going after it as much. Yeah, yeah. I, I I think well I, I I don't know apparently if since Simu's gotten better I might I might actually be worth running it honestly I might have to try it out sometime again because I tried it out with um. Mario vs. Donkey Kong, that didn't go well, because for some reason there was no sound with that. And then I tried it with... I, just for shits and giggles, I tried emulating a virtual console game, and it looked like shit. So, I'm, I'm going to try it with a more ideal game, such as uh, New Super Mario Bros. U. Because that's what I want to play on CMU. You guys, you don't want to play the Switch version? Mm-mm. That's the, understandable, Jacob. The, the Switch right. version is doo-doo. Yeah, it's poo poo. I will die on this hill for the rest of my life that the Switch version of New Super Mario Bros. U sucks. That's understandable, Jacob. I, I don't care what people said. <laughs> well, the Wii U version will always be the definitive version, I will say this much. Yeah, exactly. Now he's, he's even, even faster. faster. He, he really wants to win at F Zero. Jacob, I'm telling you this right now, but. He's he's literally goaded in this chapter. Well, of course he is. He's like your OP unit for the chapter. Yeah, he's goaded. He like I will say this once, but he's carrying it. Well, what's what's your reason, Zeppi, for getting seen you? Is there a way to, like, disable enemy phase unit animations? Yeah. Maybe you should do that. <laughs> eh, I don't want to. Okay. I just like the animations, okay? I mean, I guess. Oh. <laughs> Get ready. <laughs> Alright, bye. Some yeah, honestly, you might as well you might as well just kill um Luobano at this point. 
Yeah, I only have 10 minutes left. Nine minutes left. Oh yeah, nine minutes left. Resolve? I've never seen that before. She just speeds up. Oh, poggers. Okay, that one's really funny. What, him getting a clips? Yes. Wait, is Lu wait, where did Luo Bono go? Is he dead? No, he just ran away like a pussy. Oh, boo. It's almost two in the damn morning. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I mean, for Jose, that doesn't matter, because he does graveyard shifts all the time. For me, though, it does matter, because I like to get some shut eye at, like, one... Ooh, like, that's like, a good one. in the morning. Well, what? What is happening? Vice Minister, I lost the battle. <laughs> Fucking KFC bucket head and died. And now I'll have the opportunity to kill. You plus you have sauce. Oh, nice. Eh, what the heck? I'll just use Thoron anyways. Oh, sure, what the heck. She just uses Flare! Damn, okay. <laughs> Pink. Is the sauce any good? Look, he'll just say yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, is it is it more is it more Heather or something? I hope to God it is. <laughs> if he'll look. Well, yeah, I guess we won't know until he looks at the sauce. <laughs> he countered. He said, how fucking dare you damage me. He just one shot. Yeah, he, he's pissed. Uh-oh. Sonic, he's pissed. Ooh. Oh, that was, that was scary. That was lucky. Alright, bye. Bird up. Wow, the black okay, knight, the black knight's kind of the black knight's kind of no useless more. on this map, honestly. Okay, no more reinforcements, Jacob. No more. All right. But yeah, she really needs more speed. It's Mormon time. Nope. Well. She didn't even get a good level up, so I'm kind of sad. I mean, if she got strength, that'd be nice, too. Yeah, it would be nice. Alright, time for Slow Kayat to take out the enemy. You know, I should make I should make a list of like every game I've modded music for in in my in my current time. She's a magic unit. You dumbass. Well, yeah, I know. I know she's a magic unit. But strength... Having more strength makes you able to carry tomes more. And that... that Having more strength will allow her to double, since the tomes will almost be heavy for her. That's what I mean. Because our problem with Sonic is that she can't double. <laughs> The other problem is that you can't let her die. If she dies, it's game over. Oh, true. That's the real problem. Alright, Jacob, one more unit and that's it. Hooray! Actually, two more. <laughs> oh, shit, I forgot. 
Yeah, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. <laughs> Two more units. Yeah. Actually, three more units. I saw a third one. See why I have to give a resolve? Yep. And there's this bow guy right here. Bye bye, bow man. Bow man. What about chair man? <laughs> no, he doesn't even exist. <laughs> oh, there was also that. There was also this guy here. So that's like. Get it right. There was there was like five units left. Oh, there's a lot. So well, at least Thoron is useful. Yeah, especially because Robin keeps using it in Smash. Now I can save. Oh yeah, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna target Nephany? <laughs> Honestly, this this chapter is the reason why I hate desert uh, desert maps. Well, the path of radiance is pretty nasty too. Well, the reason it took me so long is that I had to find specific items. Oh yeah, that's that, that's definitely more of a better reason why they suck. Uh, well, at least he can't hit you. Come on, dance, Sonic. -y. Ooh, she's very close to leveling up. The last level up better be worth it, though. Bird up. <laughs> that was good timing. Hey, you got a coin! <laughs> wow, how lucky. All right, Sonaki. Dance with the power of fire. I hope you get friggin' magic, uh, speed, and probably res if I'm lucky. How, how she just gets luck? That would be bad. Okay. <laughs> glad, I'm glad to be wrong. <laughs> yes, that is the best way to end off the stream. Sir Knight, how good to see you. He always saved me from danger. Maiden, I have a favor to ask you. Will you come with me? My master awaits you at the Tower of Guidance. The Tower of Guidance? If I may ask, who is your master? You will see when we get there. Please, take my hand. We will be there in the blink of an eye. I can't. I can't leave everyone behind. We have to get to the tower together. Your allies will turn into stone when the light of judgment next shines. I do not wish for you to see it. The light will strike again. When? Please tell me. Maiden, I will come for you again. Make up your mind by then. Wait. Don't tell me he's gone again, right? I knew we couldn't count on him. Ah, uh, Soth. Lincoln got away, didn't he? Yes, he did. But we'll have another chance for the Super Mario Bros. Super Show. I'm sure of it. I know he's going to attack us again. Don't know if that's good news or bad. I know. We have to be ready. That is the that is the last time we'll see the the Silver Army. Hooray! Sigrin, Tanith, I need to talk to both of you. Empress, why so serious? Whatever it is, you can... Whatever it is, you can be sure that Sigrun and I will help you with it. Tanith, let her speak. When the last apostle was assassinated and I was not yet born, Banyan went a long time without central authority. The people are frightened, both of the murder and power vacuum. With the, without the goddess's voice, Banyan was lost. Sephiroth once told me when the Senate confirmed my appointment as the next Apostle. It was as if a sigh of relief sounded across the country. 
is true. I still remember your coordination. The first time I ever saw you, Empress Hanaki. With your tiny hand and Sep Sephiroth's, you stumbled as you walked. A little girl, barely visible in the grand hallway of, cath of the cathedral. It was a moving sight. Oh yeah, you're right. I did voice Tanith. <laughs> Yeah, you did voice her. I remember as well. The Empress stepped on her cape and tripped a total of five times. Kenneth, that's that's hardly seem appropriate. I think the country's sigh of relief was unwarranted. I cannot hear the goddess's voice. I never could. This has perplexed me for years. At first I thought my youth was to blame, but this excuse grows thinner each year. There is no clear age at which previous apostles heard the goddess for the first time, but all of them had heard by now. Empress, if this is about what Duke uh, Albano said... If I am not the true apostle, have I betrayed my people, even unknowingly? You two are, the most trust are my most trusted friends. How would you feel about me if I were not the apostle? Be honest with me. You really want an honest answer? Very well. It would not change. What? If you had thought of our alliance was the office of the Apostle, well, you were wrong. Even from a young age, you have been working with Lord Sephiroth to fight the Senate, the Senator Armstrong, on behalf of the Apostle. My loyalty lies with you, Empress Sanaki. You'll always be our Empress. Please do not forget that. I am... I am blessed. Not by the voice of the goddess, but by a loyalty like yours. Be strong, Empress Sanaki. Even if you are not the Apostle, you are, you are still the one. True Empress of Bengyun. Well, that's heartwarming. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe it took this long. 41 I mean, and a half hours. Holy shit. That long, huh, Jacob? Yep. Alright, we're back to bike. Well, Jacob, thankfully we made it to 12 p.m. I mean, a.m. for you. Once we finish the chapter. <laughs> yep, good timing. See, Jacob? Even I can try to finish the game quickly. As fast as I could. I mean, if you look, we're at three and a half hours almost, but whatever. Jacob, I try. I try to finish these chapters fast. I at least try. <laughs> we try. Yeah. Even if we reduce the five minutes, it would be like three hours or at least not 12 a.m. Mm -hmm. Chapter 4, Revelation. Re Revelations Persona. I know, I, I sorry. A, a easy, easy no, joke to make. No, it's okay, Jay. It's okay. I was about... I was uh, honestly going for a Fire Emblem Fates Revelation oh. kind of joke. This is great. I can't remember the last time we got to sleep indoors. We can be thankful for the rain, I guess. Yeah, the decorations are a little overdone, but the beds will be warm and dry. I'm glad I remembered this mansion was here. Is it Luigi's mansion? Most likely. Presumably we're the first people to set foot in here since uh, Robotnik was posthumously found guilty of trading in hair on slaves. Also, yeah, Zeppi, I have, I have looked at the sauce that you send me, so thank you. I understand that Senator Armstrong confiscated his lands and property immediately after the Mad King's War ended. You know what it means when you said Dr. Robotnik. Yep. That's right. We are recruiting him. Holy shit. Holy, Holy shit. shit. But yeah, I'm not joking. We are actually going to recruit him in a specific way. Can't wait. Well, someone must be living here. The place is spotless. By law, there shouldn't be anyone here. I wonder if someone's squatting. Well, I'll see you, Zeppi. Adios, Zeppi. Is something wrong, Raphael? I feel like we are being watched, dude. I sense no malice, but 
there is definitely some sort of presence. Perhaps the master of the house, Kawabunga. <laughs> I'll bet we'll we'll find out soon. Now's not the time for Kawabunga. It's too serious. <laughs> yeah, it's it's serious. All right. All right, Jacob. Before we end the stream, I'll check if there's more legendary we Oh, it's just an elixir. Boring. Rip. Rip. Well, let's see if there are... No. No. I mean, what's the point of getting chess keys when I know I have a freaking thief? Yeah, exactly. I think that's if your thief dies or something. I don't know. Or maybe if you didn't put a thief on your team. Alright, Jacob. This is going to be the opportunity. Let's just hope that this is the moment of truth. Think. Okay, maybe not. But the next one will be. Yes! 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 Oh, mo so there mo mommy, is. mommy maxed out all her stats. So there it is, Jacob. The perfect Tanith. I mean, Titania. <laughs> Tanith. <laughs> you know, that's, that's not what I meant to say, Jacob. But yes, I... Finally created the perfect Titania. The perfect Tiamat. Yep. Let's see if Ike can fare better. Well. Straight got strength. Yeah, I guess. But is it even worth saving? Mm hmm. Strength is always good. <laughs> I just wanted to get speed and strength. That's what I'm attempting to go for. Oh. But you know what? I'll give him a level up. If he at least gets strength. Okay, well, speed is good. I just want him to get strong enough to face the Black Knight. Yeah, fair enough. Nope. <laughs> Um, he gives Soren some level ups. Okay. More magic is nice. Come on, Ike. Give. <laughs> Res. Yeah, Res. You're not sure. I'm gonna give level up to one of my useless characters. Sorry, Jill. You're not that useful anymore. Rip, Jill. I literally got the same level up. <laughs> the same level up. Sorry, Ike. But you know I have no choice. <laughs> Come on, bike. Yeah, I think we're gonna end this stream like this. Well, at least we'll get to do chapter four next time, and chapter five. Yeah, this yeah. will be the last time we will be split up as a team. So, yeah. We're gonna get close to the freaking Tower of Guidance. Can't wait for the tower, that's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. some good yeah. shit right there. Yeah, and... But like I said, Jacob, things are going to get really scary in the Tower of Guidance because there are powerful units in that. Well, can't wait for that then. Well, yeah, anyways, gonna... well anyways, guys, thanks for watching uh, Radiant Dawn. Make sure that to like and where, subscribe. To that's the where the Twitch. frustration... But yeah, that's where the frustration starts to begin. <laughs> final frustration. Yep, final frustration. I'm deciding to bring some of my strongest units in the Tower of Guidance once we get there. Well, can't wait for that then. Oh, well, me right. too. So right. when are we going to play Radiant Dawn again? Uh, I am free on Monday. Okay, that's so, that's fine, I guess. We can do it. We can do it then. I wish you were free for three days. Yeah, I don't want to do it too often. I'm going to get burnt out if I do it more than twice a week. I know, Jacob. I just want to finish this game right now. Well, 
let's think about it. Monday, next week, we can do, um, we can finish up the rest of these chapters, and then the second day of next week, we can do the Tower of Guidance. So I think, yeah, we probably will finish it by the middle of August, I still think. I think we're gonna probably finish that game into the... Probably we're gonna finish Radiant Dawn in the third week of August. Yeah, that sounds about right. Like, I think we'll probably finish it, like, around, like, the 20th or so. Maybe the 20th or probably the 30th. Nah, probably not the 30th. We'll finish it before... We'll finish it before the 30th, I know that. Yeah, but the problem is that I'm not sure how long that will take. That's the problem. I mean, we'll see, because here's, like, how many chapters left. We're at the... We're at chapter 4 to 3, so basically, like, the fourth chapter. There are seven chapters left, including yeah, this one. Yeah, there's seven chapters left, including this one, so I'm not sure how far we'll go through. Bare minimum, four episodes left, like I said. Yeah, either four or five, if we say if we save the last chapter for last. Well, there's seven chapters, so no. we'll do we'll do um, you know two chapters each week, and then for the finale, we can do the final end game, and then whatever epilogue stuff there is, probably. Yeah, it's gonna be a really long epilogue. I will say that, and it's also gonna be a really long battle. I will say this much. Yeah, this... I mean, I'll, I'll, we'll see. I'll be the judge of it, depending on how long each of the endgame chapters take, because I don't know how long they're going to take, but I definitely don't want all of these to be, like, three and a half hour streams, because, yeah, <laughs> it gets a bit too long, if you ask me. Well, I mean, what did you expect, Jacob? This is literally the fu This is literally just the final section of the game. Of course it's going to be long. Yeah. Did you make sure to save? Yeah, I save stated. Okay, that's good. <laughs> yeah, if, uh, yeah. If 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 there's if you didn't save properly, I have a save state, so we'll be fine. Okay, that's good. But yeah, I. Uh, before we go, there's something that I want that I want to say. What? Is there legendary weapons in the next chapter? Ah, uh, let's see. Um, let's see, there is, hmm, there's a bow called the Arbalest, it is the game's strongest crossbow, so you might want that for Shinnin. Yeah, I probably do want that for Shinnin, because... but, it is, but it's in a chest, so you won't have to worry about it. Yeah, I won't worry about it because I will... Because I have Heather. Because she is literally my best thief in the game. You can also get a hidden Maelstrom from left to the stairs to Oliver's room. It's a hidden treasure. Ah, uh, I see. It's ba it's, you, basically, you basically get a dupe of the ability that um, Nutella has, which is nice. I hear there's also a really good staff weapon. I also hear that there's actually a really good staff in this um, chapter. There's Fortify, Unlock, Physic, and Sleep. Oh, I really need Fortify since it's a distance, uh, it's a distance heal kind of way. It literally heals everybody by well, a small amount of HP. You have to, um, it's just in a chest, so you'll get it automatically. You won't have to worry about that. Yeah, I will get I will get it automatically since. Oh, well, you're also oh you, oh you also get Blizzard in this chapter. Ooh, that actually sounds good. I'll give it to Soren. Yeah, so you can get you can get a bunch of good shit just from easing Heather or whoever your thief is in this chapter. Okay, well, thankfully there are no legendary weapons that I have to worry about just yet. Well, I mean there is a legendary weapon, but I think you get it from a chest, so you'll be fine. Yeah, but I don't think. There's other legendary weapons that I do want, but probably in the next chapter, there, probably the chapter after that, there is probably a legendary weapon, hopefully. Mm, let's see what that is. Um, 
there's Fenrir and Balbareth. Those are just those are just skills though, so they're not um legendary weapons. Huh, Fenrir? That sounds like a weapon that I've heard. Balbareth is a Regalia Dark Tome. It is one of the 11 SS rank Regalia weapons. So it's a it's an SS Dark Tome. I don't think you have any SS. I don't think you have any Dark users, right? No, I don't think I do. There's also Fenrir, which is a another powerful Dark spell. So, so you, there's two Dark so Tomes. So Balbareth is literally the only legendary weapon that will, that I will get. Mm, you're gonna get that good ass bow in the next chapter, so yeah, that's for sure. So I get, so I guess we have something good out of it. Yeah, you're gonna get Shinnin's best weapon in this chapter. So that's about that's what you can look forward to. Besides the double bow, that is. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll. So yeah, uh, let's just end this chapter right now. I mean, let's just end the stream right now so we could just, mm, yeah, you know, so I so I can go to bed. But anyways, yeah, guys, we... thanks for watching Radiant Dawn. Make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and Twitch as always. And we'll be back next week with more Radiant Dawn, where we finally finish the main chapters and get to the end game. So yeah, see yeah. see you guys then. See ya, Jacob.